Are you guys ready to play in our save file? Oh slash if you're if you're yearning. Any yearners? Oh my god, I forgot I have a squid hat. This is the best day of my life. I forgot about this. I sent it to you and you said thank you. I guess I just forgot. <laughs> I don't know. You put the squid hat on your cat? Fair enough. Okay. Today is day one of the night market, which is kind of exciting. Thanks for the lurk. Oh, you can brag about being top gob while you're here. All right, here we go. Night market tonight. What are the vibes? Okay, they're not happy. Oh yeah, and I was trying to smoke my perch in the mussels. We can turn that in today as well. Oh, this is quite an exciting day. Quite an exciting day, actually. Hello, cat. <gasps> what did you give me? Is that a fish I need? No, it's a ling cod. I don't think I need a ling cod. Thanks for nothing. I guess I'll just keep it for now. Three? That's okay. I got a garbage hat last episode, so I'm not mad at you. You are you're dismissed. You're allowed to live. Um, fish smoking is your favorite money maker. It's interesting. I've never smoked fish before. Is that a new part of the update? Because I feel like I've never seen it before. Uh, if you want updates about um, Kayla's cat, I would recommend following Kayla's like Discord and stuff. I think she's posting that in there. I'm not going to give you any updates about someone else's cat. Sorry. <laughs> that feels a little feels a little weird. All right. Here we go. Let's milk the cows. I wonder if the goats have milk today too. They do not. Oh yeah, and I really want my sheep and my piggies to grow up too. I feel like they're still babies though. You get one for free if you're on the Riverlands farm? Oh. Well, that's exciting. I don't know, the alpaca is just so big. Let me just double check. Can I shear you? I really want your wool. Oh, it worked! They are grown. They don't look any different than they did when they were babies, so... Yay! I have two of them. That's iconic. Yeah, I, I'm excited. I'm going to be going to the Stardew Valley Orchestra later this year. And I'm really excited for that. Very excited. <gasps> oh, it's a big day for us, chat. Starfruit day. Okay, we were going to test and see if Putting them in the dehumidifier or the dehydrate or whatever it's called is worth it. We're curious about that. So I need to actually go buy more star fruit. That's going to be on my list of things to do today before I go to the night market. Yeah, that's the downside. It's okay. I feel like the coop animals look a lot different, so... Is this grown? Still not grown, okay. All right, I got 34 golden star fruits. Holy cannoli, you guys. I would like to try the dehydrator. We're gonna make so much money. Let me just put you guys in there. Let's see what happens. And then I think I'm just gonna sell the rest of them and keep the regular ones. Yeah, I'll keep the two regular ones in there. 
perfect. Okay. I got my looms ready. Oh man, we're really starting to produce a lot of stuff now. This is good. <laughs> uh, they're coffee beans. They're coffee beans. Are most of your mods working again after the update? Um, I didn't have any mods before the update, so I've only downloaded ones that do work with the update, if that makes sense. Um, Elementalist, thank you for the 21 months. Thank you, thank you. Okay, I'm just going to go sell the rest of the star fruit. It's not that deep if... Um, I'm not going to be turning them into wine yet. Like, that's just not happening. Um, and then, oh, I need to check the bundle really quick. There was... Um, this one. I bet I could afford 100 wheat flour today. Because I do need to buy 100 wheat flour. There's no way I'm going to make 100 wheat flour. Oh, that's exciting, pirate. Good luck with that. Um, Are they always like that? Or is there a mod? Uh, For... For... Coffee beans? I always water my coffee beans. If you don't need to water them, I'm not aware of that. Boom. Bang. Okay, um... I don't think I'm gonna buy this tonight. I would be able to complete this part of the community center, but like, I don't really care about friendship right now, so I'm gonna ignore them. Um, okay. I'm going to go buy more starfruit seeds. That's very important to me. That is my priority. I do think I could perhaps make some more iridium sprinklers though. I'm gonna go check and see how many iridium ingots I have. Cause if I could do like two more iridium sprinklers in there, that would be huge. And then I could buy, it would be 40, It'd be 48 times 2, which is 96, I think? I don't know. I don't know what math is. Um, oh my gosh, Jillian! Can we get a one of us in the chat? One of my mods will be with you shortly. So make sure you have your DMs open. Also, how is the sound chat? Is it is it a good volume? I had to mess with my sound yesterday, so I want to make sure like the vibes are still good. <gasps> Miv! Hi, Miv! Sound is good? Perfect. You came at a very exciting time. Welcome. We are getting ready to go to the night market tonight. I'm glad you could join us. It looks like I'm going to be able to make... Frick, I don't even remember how to make iridium sprinklers. I can make two more. Maybe three. I'm going to make two more right now. Wait. Oh, it only takes one iridium bar? I'm pretty sure six iridium sprinklers covers the entire greenhouse. You just played Stardew for eight hours? I'm so proud of you. How do you feel? How's your farm going? I was, I was hanging out a little bit earlier. It was looking really good. I literally love that for you so much. Okay, that should not be in there. That's crazy, Miv. <laughs> I've also been streaming some pretty long hours with Stardew Valley, so I, I get it. I understand. Um, thank you for rating me. If you guys are new here, my name's Shella. I use she, her pronouns. And um, I am... I'm in the middle of a very important day. I'm, like, rebuying my... I'm rebuying my starfruit seeds, so I'm trying to like make sure I have enough time because then I also have the night market tonight and I want to go give mussels and this smoked perch to a raccoon I saw in the forest. Um, if you're new here, I'm not looking for any updates, spoilers. I'm kind of going into a blind. So if you post update spoilers, my mods will eliminate you. And that is a promise. We would hate to see that. That'd be so sad. I think that's literally covering the whole whole thing now. This is the most efficient way to, to plant. 
I don't know if I have enough money to purchase. What is, I need to, I need to look this up. How many tiles? Stardew Valley Greenhouse. Iridium sprinkler layout. How many tiles is it? 116 squares of farmable land. So because I have this, I have 116, I think. Or is it 114? Because I don't know, 112? I don't know, why didn't he make it more symmetrical, right? <laughs> Yeah, so the greenhouse, the benefits are any seed can grow there year round. So the seeds that I'm buying are summer seeds, but they're like the most profitable. Oh, I love you, Nadine. I hope you feel better. Okay, 116 is four sprinklers, two sprinklers on the wood edge. So like, like I have it right now, because these are still in the plot. I guess if I buy 116, I'll have enough for sure. Um, also, Shotzi, thank you for the first time sub. Oh my gosh, chat, you know what that means. Enjoy your emotes and your ad free viewing. But most importantly, enjoy your smile. I should just buy 116 just to be safe if I can afford it. I guess, yeah, let's go. Let's go see how much I can afford. It'll, it'll be minus one though, because I have a, I have an ancient fruit right there. So. You can actually put them on the wood. Yeah, I think that, I think that, um, you're maybe thinking of this layout. Is this the layout that you guys are thinking of? Where it's like four in the middle and then you have some on the sides. Because I'm doing, I'm doing, I'm doing, um, the six iridium sprinkler layout, which is another strat. I don't see a picture of this right now. This one. This this is how I am. Oh, wait, you're saying I can put them on the wood. Oh, I see. So I am doing this one. I just need to move. What am I doing? I'm throwing. I need to move these over one. That's what you're saying. I understand. Copy that. That's why I was like, I figure so. So then it is 116 seeds. There we go. Okay, we got there. We got there in the end. Thank you. <laughs> okay, let's go buy them. It'll be minus one though, so I'll just buy 115 because I have that uh, ancient seed there. One hundred twelve seeds, one hundred sixteen total, minus four sprinklers. Oh, so it's 112? Wait, what is it? I don't know what to do anymore. I'm so confused. <laughs> Should I just buy 116 so I have some already? I don't want to like accidentally buy less. Ooh, that's cool, Don. No, you're fine, you're fine. I'm just trying to figure out if I'm buying 116 or 112. I don't even know if I can afford that much. All right, let's just... I don't even know if I can afford it all. Also, it's the night market tonight. Am I going to want to buy anything at the night market? Probably not. So I need to buy 111. Oh. Easy. I'm literally so rich right now. <gasps> Retro rainbow shirt. I'm buying that. Um, yeah, that's fine. That's enough for now. Thanks, Sandy. Okay, I have 111. This retro rainbow shirt is actually really cool. Look at that. That's fun. I can make a fun outfit with that. Um, actually, let me let me grab this coconut. Yoink. There we go. Got it. Thanks, Hannah. Thank you, guys. I'm just I'm so bad at math that it's just really confusing for me. So thanks for understanding that I'm just I'm stupid. 
Thank you. I'm allowing math. Wow, Sari with the executive order. Allowing math. Who gave you the right to allow math in this economy? I would also like to make iridium sprinklers for these two plots coming up in um, spring, but we got we got time to let that cook. I don't think I have enough fertilizer though. That is something I don't know. I have 20 quality fertilizer. So I could make 20 quality fertilizer, but like other than that, the rest of it's gonna be normie fertilizer. How do you make quality fertilizer again? No, it's sap and fish. Okay, never mind. I was thinking about something else. I think that's deluxe bait. All right. Hey, welcome on in. Thank you so much for following. You gave me a sword. It's true. I did give you the power. Okay, I'm so sorry. I'm like in the zone. I just got to get this set up and then I'll never have to touch this again. <laughs> Can I do quality speed grow? I wouldn't want to do that because I would probably be so sad if they grew out of order. I want them to all grow at the same time. Um, so instead, I'm just going to focus on getting high quality because in the future, when I make like wine and stuff, that's going to be like really big, you know? I don't know. For now, I'm just going to do fertilizer. Um, okay, let me just put down... I have 20 quality fertilizer. Let's just put that up here. It's okay. I mean, everyone can do it the way that they want to do it. That's like the beauty of Stardew Valley. This is just the way Shella Shellerson wants to do it. You know? How do I make more than... Why won't it let me make more than one at a time? Oh, God. Oh, my God. Yeah, isn't that crazy? I hate when the fairy does that. <laughs> it's like she thinks she's being helpful. And I'm like, how could you? I'm out of order now. And then as the days go by, I can replace the regular fertilizer with quality fertilizer when I have enough. It's just I do not have enough right now. So. Okay, I made too much fertilizer. That's okay. Let's plant all of this. We're doing so good. The fact that I have a full greenhouse year one, I don't think I've ever had that before. I feel like we've gotten really lucky with our iridium drops. We're doing really good, you guys. Hi, Naomit. How are you? Okay, the night market is open now, so I don't think I can go visit the raccoon today. We'll visit them tomorrow. It was like a little more important for me to get these planted at the time. And then I have my one ancient fruit seed. We did the math wrong. Soiled it. Can I get back to the desert? Oh my God. This is why math is banned. Cause none of us can do it. How is that even possible? Pam. I could just restart the day. I think that's a little dramatic, but I could. <laughs> Is that too dramatic? I don't know. I, I, uh, I, the math made sense to me. <gasps> that's exciting, Nath, congrats. 
I'd restart. Okay. Sorry, everyone. I hope you understand. I I mean, I could have done the seed maker, but then I'd be waiting and I have the night market tonight. It's a whole thing. So that means I need 115 seeds. 115 seeds. That's okay. We can do it. Everything's fine. I didn't do anything like crazy. I was just running around doing stuff. It's going to be okay. We're going to be more efficient this time. I might actually, because of how efficient we're being, I might be able to, um, what are you? A periwinkle? Okay. I might actually be able to do the raccoon today if we do it faster. I bought 111. Um, that was the number chat chat settled on. So I had 111 because one of my tiles is full. Okay, so what I need to do, I'm gonna take care of my animals. I'm gonna shear my sheep and milk my, my things, milk. Then I need to go, I need to make four iridium, four iridium sprinklers. And then I need to um, go to the desert, buy 115 seeds, buy the shirt, sell the star fruit before I go to the desert. Okay, we can do this. We're min maxing right now. Where's my gold? I, I have to harvest my star fruit, guys. Don't worry. Don't worry. I went, I harvested it, and then I sold it to Pierre before I left. It's gonna be okay. Um, I don't think I need to add it to the list. It's in my, it's in my brain. If I forget something, then it's on me, <laughs> I guess. I'm just trying to go fast. Okay, loom. All right, here we go. Um, eight row. I want to put this here. And then I need to make iridium sprinklers. Four of them. One, two, three, four. I declare a thumb war. Okay, and then I'm going to go set it up. Maybe I could buy quality fertilizer from Pierre today, too. I had enough money. Yeah, the the day isn't going to be different. It's going to be the same. It's predetermined. No, it's okay. I'm not blaming anyone. I'm not blaming anyone at all. We were all just a little confused on if it was 112 or 116. It's going to be okay. It's not that deep. I spent a lot of time talking anyways. Um, one, one, two, one, two. Okay, there we go. I'll be back. Need 4,600 simoleons. Copy that. And then I put these guys in the dehydrator. Blink, because I wanted to see how much those would make me. And then I put these guys here. And then I, I'm going to drink coffee so I go fast. And I need to go to Pierre's. At Pierre's, I will sell the star fruit. I'm going to see if he has deluxe fertilizer. And then we're going to go to the desert. And we'll be good. We'll have everything we need. Oh, maybe the mail system's different. Either way, it's not the worst. I'm not going to be upset if I can't have that shirt. Boom, I'm rich. Okay, no, he only has basic fertilizer. I think maybe he gets deluxe fertilizer next year. Thanks for nothing, Pierre. Oh yeah, med check in chat. Make sure you take your meds. Everything's gonna be fine. We're gonna do great. It's 10 a.m. and I'm already on my way to the desert. Like, I'm literally meeting Pam at the bus. That is how good I am. I am speed. Let me in. <laughs> You can trick the system with Pam's mail and reset the day until you get the battery. Ooh, that's interesting. That must be like a, a speedrunning strategy or something. 
Let me in. Okay, so 115. Bye. There we go. We can go see the raccoon today. We're going to have enough time. So you need 116. Uh, one of my tiles is already occupied with like an ancient fruit. So I'm not going to like delete that. I'm just going to keep it. Eventually I'll need 116. But for this first batch, I will be fine with 115. No, it's good thinking. Um, deluxe fertilizer. Okay, let's go. I think you have to hold shift to get it to go up by five. Something like that. One of those keys. We're doing amazing chat look at us look at us go i forgot how much fertilizer i need to make i think 50 was too much but it's whatever there we go Whew. and now That's a game changer. You're welcome. Whee! This is so fun. I'm so hard focused right now. <laughs> it's going to be so satisfying seeing all of this grow too. We did it! Rish claps. Let's go. You can also shift control to get 25 items at a time. Oh, I didn't know that. That's kind of wild. How did I get so much money so fast? Boy, it's not a simple answer. Um, I just set myself up for financial success. Um, I guess if you really want to know, I, I am uploading all of these episodes to my YouTube channel so you can like go back and see like the decisions I make if that helps. But, um, there we go. We did it. Billionaire by year two. Yeah, probably. We'll see. Um, oh yeah, I wanted to make an outfit using the uh, treasure chest. Okay, let me just put all of this stuff away that I don't need. La 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 la. Oh, I'm so freaking, you guys have no idea how happy I am right now that I have a full greenhouse. Like that is something that is always one of my big goals is getting a full greenhouse and I have one already. That is really exciting. Oh yeah, if you're new to Stardew Valley, I would absolutely by no circumstance at all compare yourself to what I'm doing. I'm kind of crazy. Whoa, a pirate hat? Oh my god, I'm so wearing that tonight. Are you joking me? Yarg. It is I, Captain Scheller. Oh, I'm so excited. That was worth it. Instead of selling that for whatever it was, it was like 5,000 5, simoleons. I got a pirate hat instead. I'm a little gay pirate. Best day of my life. Let me change my shoes. Actually, no, I'm just going to keep them. I'll only wear this for tonight. Okay, now I want to go give the mussels and the perch to the raccoon. Because I can do that today. I was way more efficient with my time. So let's go. Yay. 
Hey. Luan finally got the Fez last night. Finally. Oh my god. I bet it was an epic moment. More powder melons. Okay, hello, my friend. I have brought to you your mussels and your carp. Thanks, Bobo. Take this. 25 powder melon seeds? Oh my god. Now maybe I find a wife. What the? <laughs> okay, good luck with that. <laughs> what an icon. I love them. He calls me, they call me Bobo. I guess I'll plant these powder melon seeds because they grow in seven days. I have like a whole scrungly ass farm over here, so might as well. I'll just rehoe it real quick. There we go. Might as well. Oh, that one's like a different color. Oh, maybe because it's not um watered. That's probably it. That makes sense. Um, on that note, I guess I should water it. And then we're gonna go to the... Is it? Okay, so the night the night market is in town for three days. And isn't it the best price to buy the super cool rainbow hat on the second day? I believe the strategy is, right? <laughs> Who am I planning to marry? I'm gonna marry Sophia. All right, just hoeing around, you know me. I'm gonna bring my fishing rod too. That's right, I could get a blobfish or something exciting. Um, do I have my deluxe bait? Yeah, I do. All right, yeah, let's, let's go. To the salon. It's cheapest on the second day. All right, I will save my money then. I don't think I have the second dwarf scroll yet. I, I haven't been getting it. Uh, Sophia is a person that comes with Stardew Valley Expanded. Ooh. Don't mind if I do. Hi, Harvey. Oh, there's a quest over here. Gus's famous omelet. I have the urge to make my famous giant omelet, but I need two dozen eggs. Or, hey, I have an idea for a new bed, but I need 80 hardwood. Um, I'll do the eggs first. I want to keep my hardwood for my own projects. Um, I don't actually know Olivia. Um, I don't think it makes it easier. Hello! Can I have my free coffee? Thank you. Oh, I already have enough eggs for my bundle. Ooh, all right, all of the seasonal decor is here. These cloud banners are cute. I'll buy like two of those. I don't know if I already have those, but it's fine. The hat is incredible, thank you. I have a pirate hat. <laughs> Fresh hardwood, by the way. Oh, yeah, I don't have time for that right now. I want to get to know Sophia, but I never have anything she likes. Pro tip, um, if you go fishing, since you have Stardew Valley expanded, if you go fishing on the bridge to the far east, like past the blacksmith and everything, um, you can catch puppy fish there, and she really likes those. That's what I've been giving her. Um, so, yeah. Yeah, I like the night market too. Maybe I'll get a seasonal plant. Just for fun. Okay, what else? Ooh, it's my favorite traveling merchant. Do you have a fish I need? No, just a rare crow. I think I already have that rare crow. 
pomegranate seed, radish seeds, prep truffle oil. Mm. Sure. I'll take it. Hello. <gasps> Stone frog. And then I'll buy the cone hat tomorrow. Iridium fireplace. Upright piano. Oh, I feel like that's new. Stone frog. <laughs> the puppy fishes creep me out. Aw, they do. All right, let me go to the mermaid. You haven't missed too much. I haven't even played through a day yet. Here we go. Enjoy the show. An ad at the bottom of stream? Hmm, I don't know. Oh, ew, that's gross. I know, I love the mermaid. Uh, I use the Logitech Aurora collection. She's so cool. Yeah, I want to be her friend, too. Icon! Round of applause! <laughs> She's really cool. Isn't it magical? I forget the order. Okay, it's... There we go. I remember it from sound. Pearl! Yippee, yippee! Thank you! You want to be one of the backup singer mermaids? That'd be fun. All right, now I'm going to go fishing for the rest of the night. Here we go! Bonjour! Here we go. Deep sea fishing. Did I get the extra luck pendant with the rabbit's foot? Um, I'm not sure what that is. I turned my rabbit's foot into the, the bundle. Because I, I needed one for the wizard bundle. Oh, this hat, this is a, a pirate hat. I got it from um, the treasure chest that you get from the Squid Fest. <gasps> Yay! Oh my gosh! Enjoy your, your emotes, Claire, <laughs> and ad free viewing. Ooh, a pearl. Oh my god. Oh, that's awesome, Ashlyn's. I'm glad to hear that. Also, if you're new here, I have the fishing mod. I just don't like fishing, so hope that helps. <laughs> Blobfish! Oh my god, that's so exciting. I love him. Oh, the mermaid is canonically a lesbian. I love that! Very good. Lots of seaweed. I have my deluxe bait, so I'm hoping to catch a lot of good fish. Another blobfish! I already finished the master fishing bundle, though, so... Ooh, super cucumber. All right. I used to have a pond for those. It's getting late. It'll be fine. Oh, 
we go. I don't know what, like, the rarest thing is that you can catch down here. Is it the blobfish? Oh, you never put fish in your fish pond? Uh-oh. Hi, Bruin! Sounds like you had a lovely day! Oh, you're new to the game and you're downloading mods? I love that for you, Bloom. All right, one more. One more fish. Octopus or a pearl? Oh, well, I got a pearl. Let me out. Let me out. Let me out. <laughs> yes, my Stardew is modded. Let me out. Oh my god, I'm literally gonna die. I should have left earlier. Oh. No. No. <laughs> I passed out in my house. Come on, that's fine. That's fine, right? Oh my god. I shouldn't have caught that last fish. Um, I definitely recommend looking up Expanded on the internet because they, they can give you a little bit more information about it, but I really like it. Your pomegranate tree wasn't able to grow last night. Oh no! Oh, those sprinklers are going to be in the way of my trees, aren't they? Hmm... What should I do? At least, did I get charged money? I might have. No. Oh, passing out in the house is fine now, isn't it? That's right. Whew. Okay. I gotta organize my stuff here. I'm very excited about my blobfish. I'm gonna keep these midnight squids, too. In fact, um... I kind of want to... Okay, I have a couple of those, so I'll sell those. Put that in there. Gotta organize my stuff. I'm very, like... If you're new here, I'm very, like, particular <laughs> with how I organize my stuff, so... Sorry if it gets a little bit annoying. Okay, furniture... Okay. Yeah, my energy is at half, but that's okay. I have so much mayonnaise. I can just chug that like crazy. I want to see, I feel like this turns into something. Yeah, this is really important to me. Yeah, this is good. I feel like myself. I feel really good. Yeah, it's fun to see how people organize their stuff. I've never felt more beautiful. Okay, dried star fruit. Oh! Wait. Pause. How much is a, a star fruit on its own? This was five silver star fruits. 5,650 simoleons? That might be a new meta. That's kind of crazy. It is a good profit. I might need to make some more of those. That is kind of crazy. Okay, so here's the thing. I have a pomegranate tree here that can't grow because of this sprinkler being here. So I'm going to have to come in and water these every morning until the pomegranate tree is grown. So it's going to be like a month of watering, which is kind of annoying. But I guess it's my bad for planting them on like next to the wood versus next to the edge of the, the wall. So... Yeah, literally stonks. 
Uh, do I have the tiller profession? No, I think I have the, um, the rancher profession. Because I'm on the, I'm on the, the meadow farm. So I want animal products to be worth more. I do be a farmer. Howdy. Oh, that's not my goat. Five silver star fruit without tiller is worth. Okay, so then it is a profit. It is good for us to put them in the dehydrator. Good to know. You have 32 ancient seeds saved up for your greenhouse. Oh my goodness. One, two, three, four. Okay, yeah, there we go. Link block. Perfect. <gasps> A duck feather! Oh, that's my first one. You got to level 98 of the Skull Caverns. That is so tragic that you passed out before floor 100. I would cry. My thoughts are with you on this day. Where's the other duck egg? There has to be two. That's rough. Where's the other duck egg? Oh, I got a feather instead of a duck. I'm stupid. <laughs> Literally five seconds ago. Yay, a duck feather. <laughs> oh my God. Sorry, everyone. Sorry. Okay, got some coffee brewing. Um, I don't really know what to do with this duck feather. I don't need it for anything. I guess I'll keep it in my artisan chest for now. Oh yeah, I do have an eggs quest for Gus, and I did in fact just turn all of my eggs into mayonnaise. So that was really dumb of me. I need to remember not to do that tomorrow. That was really dumb of me. Whoops. All right, let me make a note. These things are done, so let me complete these quests. Also, I was going to see, like, traveling merchant. Can I make that, like, something that repeats every... Wait. Monday and... No, it's Friday and Sunday, right? So that way it will show up on Fridays and uh, Saturdays. So I remember. Okay, um, save eggs. There we go. Wait, why is... Oh, it's not showing up because it's not. I'm literally dumb. My brain is a little slow today, you guys. Please bear with me. What do I need to do today? Other than, I guess... I don't know. I kind of want to build more barns and coops so i think i think i was saving to upgrade my coop so i think today i'm gonna go chop down all the wood oh hi violet oh this my my beautiful natural beauty is what you're asking about um this is just what i look like this is my face am i not magnificent are you not in love with me Do I have enough stone? I do. Okay, so I am going to wait. Okay, to upgrade my tool to gold, I think I need I think I need 10,000 simoleons, right? <laughs> it's good to see you though, Violet. <laughs> yeah, if you guys are wondering what mods I used, uh you can type exclamation point star mods or it's pinned at the top of chat. So you can check the list there. It is always there. 
I need 10,000, don't I? Well, it's a good thing I have a bunch of stuff. I guess I could go sell half of my mayonnaise. I'll just do that. <laughs> yeah, those are the ones Violet and I are going to be using tomorrow. There's a couple of updates. So. I don't have 20 cows. I only have four, Emily. What do you mean? Please don't drink the mayo. Oh, well, I'm a goblin, and goblins in Stardew Valley drink mayonnaise. You look beautiful today, Shella. And Shad, of course. <laughs> Love love. Oh, Isley, thank you so much. And thank you for the 32 months. That's so nice of you. Thank you. Yeah, like goblins canonically drink mayonnaise. So it's just in my nature. I hope you understand. It's just who I am. This is my face. I finally decided to stop wearing makeup and this is what I look like. I hope you're happy. Easy, breezy, beautiful. Oh, there's a train. Where's Clunt? Does Clunt not work on Tuesdays? Oh my god. Where is he? I'm going to kill him. Where is he? <laughs> I said what I said. Um, I have not seen the goblin mask, no. Nor do I really want spoilers on how to get it. No, I have not. I'm so mad. Did anything come out of this? My whole plan today was to get a, a golden pickaxe. Is he at the community center? I don't know. It's not completed yet. Why would he be there? Does he just randomly go there? It's his clinic day? Oh my god, so you're telling me he's out there taking care of his health instead of standing at his workstation like he should be? I can't believe this man. And I got a mystery box. Guess what I can't do with that today? Open it. Because someone's getting his health checked up on. I hate him. He's not there on Fridays either? What? I can't believe this. Lots of clay, though. Exciting. All right. Well, that's fine. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go deforest so I can get my deluxe coop. Lots of foraging stuff. God had my hoe and I need to clear around my fruit tree. I can't believe him. He was blocking you on purpose. Evil man. Oh, is the goblin mask not new? I must have just not known about it before then. I guess I haven't played Stardew Valley like long term in a while like do you guys remember the um what was the update before the 1.6 update the one that was like a chonker i didn't fully play through that update so there's probably a lot of things that i'm not aware of 1.5 well okay duh it's the 1.5 is that actually what it is <laughs> duh <laughs> no but like i i'm just like there's a lot of things that i'm like probably don't know i haven't played through ginger island yet if that helps like i've i've done ginger island a little bit but i have not like i've not done perfection and i've not um completed ginger island yet if that gives you more perspective um also like i'm not i'm not actually mad or anything i'm just like oh <laughs> i didn't know that was a thing it's not that deep um, okay, I have seven more powder melon seeds, but I don't know if I want to plant them. I guess I could. Trash. 
yeah i'm excited like i i had fun at ginger island i just haven't um i haven't fully finished it yet so there are lots of things for me to discover there we go here we go all right Yeah, I don't know. It's kind of a touchy subject. <laughs> I'm sorry if you're if you're scared to like give me any quote unquote fun tips or anything, but as a streamer, I'm like super overprotective of like people spoiling things for me because it happens all the time. So I hope that you can understand my perspective is like not wanting to like have people come in and be like, "Did you know about this? Did you know about this?" Well, now I do. <laughs> it happens so often, so I'm just on the defense already live streaming um always on the defense it's just like an unfortunate thing and nobody really has bad intentions when they do that either so i'm never mad i'm just like well <laughs> there goes another one <laughs> it's okay i'm gonna go get my bisexual hat as i should i deserve this i think it Everyone says it's cheapest on night two, which is a pro tip, if you ask me. Ooh, how much is this? Yeah, I'll buy it. Why not? No need to be sorry. It's okay. Don't worry about it. All right, and stone parrot. I'm buying stone parrot as well. What else do I buy? I don't need that. Should I go fishing again? <gasps> Sophia's here! That's Marnie. What? Sniff. I'm not in the mood. Sorry. Oh, I think she's crying again. That's okay. You're further than me, so no spoilers for me. <laughs> Fair enough. Um. Hmm. I don't know if I need any of these fish. Do I need a flounder? No, 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 no. Wait. No, it was a perch. The carp and the perch just look similar. I was thinking like, I think I just caught one, but no, I was, it was a different one. At first I thought she was smelling you. Oh my God, can you imagine Sophia just like sniffs you? You smell good. I don't know about that vibe. I feel so beautiful right now. I'm gonna go catch more fish, I guess. I did, I got the hat. But do I want to be bisexual or do I want to be a blobfish? These are the important questions we must ask ourselves. What's more important to me? Which one? Just as spongy as the real thing. Yeah. Ooh, I don't like that. <laughs> oh my god. Bisexual blobfish erasure. <laughs> Hey, Cozy Korok, thank you for the one year resub. Thank you, thank you. Uh, I appreciate it. Welcome back. The two genders, bisexual and blobfish. Those are the only two. What are you? Oh my god, you're ugly. Is that a part of Expanded or is that part of the base game? We are in the deep ocean. It is base game? Oh my god. Disgusting. So ugly. <laughs> I feel like I've never seen her before, but also whenever I play Stardew Valley, I don't do the fishing. My husband does. So like right now I'm being so brave. This is me putting on my, my brave shoes fishing the mod made me more confident 
I just don't want to embarrass myself in front of you guys. You know? My husband and I are the opposite. That's actually a fun question. When you play Stardew Valley with someone else, what task do you do? Like, or do you do, does everyone do the same thing? Or is there one that's like, I do the fishing or I do the, the farming? You fish for your mom? You fish? You pet the cat? You go straight to the mines? That's so nice, Bruin. You only did the mines and the fishing? You've never played co-op? Oh my gosh, it's fun. It's fun playing with other people. So fun. I do everything and he chases me around and puts fences in front of my house. Delete. Delete. Usually when I play with Tony, I'm the one that has to take care of all the farming and the animals and stuff. And he just goes and fishes. I'm like, thanks a lot. All right, I'm tired. I don't feel like drinking mayonnaise today. Oh, I like that. You do even in odd days. That That's a good, like, little system there. Love that. <laughs> when you play with Omar, he decorates and you mine a love. That's fun. I don't think I have anything that Sophia would want right now. Sorry, love you. Also, I love Haley's winter outfit. Like, she's so pretty. You're so pretty. Did I go to this guy today? I did, right? Yeah, I got the cone hat. That's the main thing I needed. Yeah, I didn't have any egg smoothies tonight. I didn't. I forgot it was my wedding in Stardew and I'm in a dumb hat. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> okay, I'll keep the regular midnight squid. I will sell these ones. I'm gonna keep these spook fish. And throw these in here. Sure. Why the heck not? And then Put this in here, in here. This is very exciting. I already have the stone owl, so like they're gonna have, they're gonna be best friends. They're gonna have so much fun. Um, I guess I can sell that. Prehistoric hand axe. I turned it into a uh, shirt and it gave me a lumberjack shirt. And a baguette. I forgot to ch chop down wood today. That was what I was gonna do. Somebody got lost in the plot. That's okay. Yeah, you have to work to bed. Mm -hmm. Okay, look at us. I cannot believe how much this star fruit, dried star fruit, that is one jar of dried star fruit. So technically five. And it, I don't know. So when you dry things, does it matter what quality they are when they go in? Because I put silver star fruit in, but if I use a regular star fruit for that, will it will it be cheaper? You need five of the same. Well, yeah, but like if I do regular star fruit, will it still give me this much? They come out the same value. Okay, that's good to know. That's so I would not want to put gold star fruit in there because I, I would be selling at a uh, a loss. I think silver still sells at a profit if I do that. But gold might be at a loss. Oh, it's the wizard's birthday today. I should humble his Borpna. I'm going to go give him a void essence. Oh, that's too much math for me. Shella, sorry to bother you again, but I need another favor. I got a new hammer and I want to try it on a variety of metals. Could you smelt an iron bar and bring it to me? Clint, where were you yesterday when I needed you? Huh? 
freaking Clint. Do I need to actually smelt a new iron bar? No, I just need to bring him one. Okay. Whatever. I'm going to go upgrade my pickaxe again or try to today. He better be there. If Clint isn't there, I riot. That's just what's going to happen. <laughs> Hi, Kayla. Just don't do it with gold. Okay. Exactly the same. Yeah, Clint abandoned us when we needed him most. Of course he wants a favor now. Of course. Typical. Three powder melons. Perfect. Okay, I do have to go... And because of where my pomegranate tree is growing, I have to water a little bit in here. I have an iridium sprinkler, but... Oh! Hey, ancient fruit! I have an iridium sprinkler, but... um, I have a pomegranate tree right there. Also, my orange tree is fully grown. I just got my first orange today. Yippee, yippee! That is exciting! Thank you! It's my blobfish mask. But I just found out that there's a goblin mask, so that's my new goal. I'm gonna figure it out. So that I can truly become myself. Okay, so for the ancient fruit, am I supposed to turn that into more ancient seeds? Is that the meta? got two lucky lunches from a mystery box nice i just i don't know what the meta is that's what you do i'll have to see if i have a seed maker because i don't think i have one of those yet that's what you do too oh yeah sorry i forgot you have no milk today let me i have an alpaca let me trim you There we go. How do I make a seed maker? Oh, I can do that. So is it better to have ancient fruit in the greenhouse or star fruit? Like what's the end game? They reproduce every few days. Starfruit is worth more as wine. And if you're going to cask it and age it to iridium, I think it's worth doing starfruit. But ancient fruit produces perpetually, so most people just do that. Okay. Because then, yeah, you don't have to, like, invest in the seeds again. So my, my end term goal is to um, basically... All right, this is going to be Clint's chest, or... Gus's chest, whatever. My end goal is to have ancient fruit. <laughs> don't worry, don't worry. You can scream at me to save the eggs. I get it. Sometimes I'm dumb. Do I want to put my sweet gem berries into the... the seed maker? Or do I just want to sell those? Or give one to... Mr. Cannoli, or whatever his name is. I think that's what I'm supposed to do. Maybe one of them? Go ancient fruit, not processors? What does that mean? I don't know what you're saying. I have ancient fruit on the island and star fruit in the greenhouse. And I have a modded greenhouse expansion. You lose money if you put a sweet gem berry in the seed maker. Okay, so I'm going to put my ancient fruit in the seed maker then. Final option. 
I'm doing it. It's done. No one stopped me. <laughs> okay, um, on my list today is Void Essence to the Wizard. Cut down the trees. I'm gonna drop off my bar really quick before I go do that. It'll be good. Also, have I given Sophia a present? Oh, Sophia and George. Okay. Sophia, George, add them to my list. Do I have anything for George? I don't have any leeks anymore, but I think I have pepper to give him. And then for Sophia, I have fairy rose. Okay. We have a lot going on today. Busy day ahead of us. I just meant ancient fruit for long term, even though it's a longer setup. Okay. So I will like slowly fill my greenhouse with ancient fruit then. And then when I get all the ancient fruit, I don't want to turn them into wine. I just want to sell them. Half star fruit and half ancient fruit. Yeah, maybe that's a good strategy right there. Oh, this is just my face. Do you like it? I feel beautiful. Ooh, bombs. I'll take that. Thank you, Clunt. Okay. Golden pickaxe, please. Thanking you. Also, I have this for you. Yeah, you're welcome. Yeah, you can plant the ancient seeds. Um... Okay, now I need to go to Sophia and George. <laughs> I don't know if you should skip your rehearsal, Tizza. That doesn't sound smart. But also, I'm the demon on your shoulder and I say maybe you should. So I should put the ancient fruit in the kegs? I don't know, maybe I should read up about this. There you go. Why, do you not like it, George? I want your spicy eel recipe. I personally love it, thank you. I feel beautiful. <laughs> All right, where is Sophia? I can stop by. Oh, copper bar? Sure. I'll stop by Sophia and then go to the quiz head. And then I will cut down the forest. That's my, my agenda today. Oh, turning the desert into a winery. Oh, that's kind of exciting. So then you you would do star fruit in the greenhouse and ancient fruit on the on the island. My favorite character in my TV show passed away last night, so I'm upset. I feel like locking myself in my room for the rest of the day. That's literally so relatable. There you go. Sorry that happened to you. The blobfish is the highlight of my day. Okay, sounds good. Starfruit in the greenhouse, ancient fruit on Ginger Island. Sold to the highest bidder. That's what we'll do. That's the strategy for goblin farms. I feel like you guys are my board of advisors. How does it feel that your client is me? A blobfish. More like a, a gobfish. Okay. Nothing really that I want. What, you don't like my face roll? For your advisors, you chose poorly. Did I? I feel like you guys are smart. Hello, wizard. I'm here with your void essence on your birthday. Where are you? Are you in your basement? Mm -hmm. 
Sorry to interrupt. How many moons have passed? Time is merely a journey. Thank you for remembering this day and the kind gift. You're welcome. You've never seen Stardew Expanded. This is neat, isn't it? It adds a lot of fun things. I feel like if you've played through Stardew Valley before, like getting Stardew Valley Expanded is kind of fun. What? You were just in the basement. How did he get here? Someone make it make sense. Hello? I guess he can teleport. So, one moment. I must assess the strength of this barrier. Looks like he's trying to poop. Everything good? It should hold steady for another six seasons. Hmm, I see. Let me explain. While Stardew Valley often seems tranquil, monsters do lurk in its darker corners, particularly deep in the woods. West of my tower, there are dangerous slimes that attack any human they see. As the resident magic practitioner of Stardew Valley and Pelican Town, it is my responsibility to maintain the magical barrier that prevents monsters from kicking or attacking. I don't know why I said kicking. When a witch or wizard chooses their home, they also swear to protect the residents of that home. Camilla, the witch of the castle village, is exceptionally talented. She leads the vanguard, fighting off the hordes of monsters in Galdora. The barrier she oversees is the largest in the world and requires immense amounts of mana to maintain. Ooh. My apologies, Shella. I must attend a council meeting. Okay. Bye. Scary. Yeah, this is this is a mod. Stardew Valley Expanded is not officially a part of the game. Um, it's a it's a mod, but I think it's pretty well integrated. Yeah. Oh, that's good to know, Emily. I'm currently watching the Among Us VOD on YouTube, but wanted to pop in and say hello. Hello! Thanks for watching the VOD. There is a hotter wizard mod you can install. Froggy, thank you for the three months! Why are you dying? Do you think he and Gale would be friends? Gale from Waterdeep? Oh yeah, I heard that there was a female wizard mod. Isn't she like really hot? Oh, you're sick and it's the start of a college quarter. That does not sound fun. I'm sorry to hear that. That Among Us stream was something. Yeah, it was a lot. It was a lot. You just started watching Momo's Baldur's Gate 3 playthrough. That's fun. Momo's playing through a Dark Urge run right now, so I can't watch because I haven't done Dark Urge yet. Yay, have fun, Bambi. What if I got the Asterian mod? That's an option, but I'm already going for Sophia. I don't know if there's really any point for me going to the night market again tonight. I guess to get the last statue, maybe. But I don't think I wanted to go, like, fishing again. Is there, like, different fish you can catch every night? Or is it the same fish? Hi, Swiss! Thank you for the 11 months. I appreciate it. All right, going back. Hi. Yeah, I'm gonna go check the wares. This is not. This is not It's Gooby. Hi, Olivia. Hi, baby. I believe the fish are the same, just different people attending in store inventories. Okay, I'm gonna go check out because there's a statue I want to get. Hi, Tony. Hey, um, what do you think? 
Mm -hmm. One, did you know you had Rayla in here? No. Yeah, she's in the... She's oh, she's in the cat tree? She was silent. I didn't hear her come in. Yeah. Move! And two, is it too late for coffee? Um, no, I would take coffee. Small plants. Do I need perch? Yes. No. Always need perch. No. No. No, I do not. I do not need perch. Perch is delicious. You just noticed the blobfish? Do you mean my face? My beautiful natural face? Are you saying I look like a blobfish? No. Have you add the cone hat? I already have that. Oh. I feel beautiful. Blue Mary Love, you do not need to perch. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Tony really likes bad jokes. He just made his night. <laughs> wow. Uh, retreat, Tony, save yourself. Um, this is what ma this is what married life is like, guys. You just pick on each other. Okay, I don't need to fish. La 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 la. This joke reminds me of my dad. Yeah, it it is the it is the job of the boyfriend slash husband. To annoy stuck through all this trash. How is that possible? To annoy your partner and uh, make jokes that they don't find funny and laugh at it yourself. And watch them cringe. See? Look at that. Cringing. Hard. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, chat's really impressed with how you did at hide and seek last night. Yeah. They were like, you're scary. Yeah. I might be really bad at lying, but I, being a seeker and hide and seek, really kind of lying. kind of scary. You you had like a heat seeker on. You were like smelling the blood. Yeah, it was smelling everyone's stank. Ew. <laughs> I have stank. Your musk is very strong in that game. <laughs> oh my god! Uh, I never want to hear you say that again. What? You don't like your own musk? No, I don't. I don't want to hear. I don't like that word. You can't say that to me. Yeah, your your aura. No, no. Your aura. You need to leave right now. <laughs> you need to get out of here. I'm sorry, everyone. The aroma. <laughs> I'm so sorry that this man is a thing. Yay! I have three ancient seeds now. Actually, I think I have the recipe for this, don't I? Oh, that makes sense. <laughs> everyone's agreeing with me. <laughs> well, everyone's wrong. How does that sound? I'm going to keep these to grow on the island. He says the most out of pocket things on stream. What do you mean? You guys, he's like this in real life. I don't think you understand. You think that this is a stream performance? I live with this every waking hour of the day. It's so painful. Someone send help. Help me. Please, you don't understand. This is not just for stream. This is my life. Ooh, my mushrooms are done. Help. <laughs> she don't need a blink if she needs rescuing. She's I'm telling say, you. She's just saying. <laughs> Rescue me. Ooh, iridium mushroom. That was pretty impressive. I chose this. Uh, it's unfortunate, isn't it? Your BF. <laughs> my BF has my face right now. So oh you, my god, your, no. Your boyfriend and I would be best friends. 100%. Oh my god. The men can go on play dates together. And we would. You know what we would do? Save me, Silicons, please. We would le legit just chill. We wouldn't. We would make fun of you guys. The way that when we went to TwitchCon, all of the the husbands got together and went to a concert together. Yeah. Because we were like busy doing streamer stuff, 
they're like okay we're gonna go see a concert bye and they had just met each other <laughs> we're yeah. like what yeah. like i didn't even actually i don't even think i remembered everyone's names yet yeah you literally were like nice to meet you concert <laughs> well it was either that or we were just going to like i could never yeah, it was either that or we were all going to hang out in our own rooms and just, like, sit on our phones. Yeah, I guess when you're in Vegas, right? Yeah. Might as well do something fun. <sighs> Abondo Tony, annoyed when he's here, lonely when he's not... What? No loneliness. At all. No, they're calling me out. Oh. <laughs> You're lonely without me? Oh, that's so sweet. No, I never said that. Those words never came out of my mouth. That's so sweet. You and your aroma. Stop. <laughs> You're... People are going to think I smell bad. They already called me Rishmella. I mean, you... I mean... Huh? <laughs> Did you just sniff me on camera? Mm -hmm. For free? <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh my god. You're about to pass that up. No, I'm not. Yeah. I have time. I'm aware. You have no energy. I'm not doing anything else. I'm just organizing myself. Can you leave? <laughs> Can you leave? <laughs> Stop backseat gaming. <laughs> My God. Ooh, I could turn these into. You're not backseat gaming. I'm gonna do that. I hate him. Wait, oh, can I turn something? I wanted to see what kind of hat this made. And then there was something else I wanted to turn into a hat. Was it just the fish? Metro, I get free sniffs. Because what? Well, I mean, I'm not. I'm not gonna go into what? that. <laughs> what are you saying right now? Leave. <laughs> I. I don't want to scare you, but there's something. Get out of my room! <laughs> I don't know what's happening. By the way, my dogs are. No! <laughs> Stop! Is this gonna make a squid hat? Oh, a fishing hat. Okay, that's not as cool as I was hoping for. Oh, <gasps> strapless top. Oh my god, you guys, I have my new summer outfit. This is quite exciting. Literally, the best thing about cloth is experimenting with it. Okay, good night. Oh my god. Wait, oh my gosh, Emily! Hot Goblin Redemption, can we get a Mahab in the chat? Let me go ahead and hop you right now. On my way. Get in here. We're going hobbing. Welcome to the Hobgoblins. I'm a hob. <laughs> I'm fun to watch. Thank you. Thank you. I'm glad. Sometimes I feel like imposter syndrome. So that means a lot. And by sometimes, I mean every day I open my stream and I'm like, what am I doing? I, I don't, I shouldn't be here. Who are these people? Where am I? The blobfish mask stays on in bed. It does. It does. Okay, I'm actually gonna wear my cute outfit um, now. I'm, I'm done wearing my blobfish hat. It was fun for a little bit, but I am going to take my clothes off and put on my blue ribbon and my blue long vest. There we go. Perfect. Sorry, I'm interrupting you because you know, I realized I didn't eat lunch, so I'm so excited. Can you see?
you just bring them both home? Okay. They're just saying it's gonna be a little longer. Okay. Mm. Okay. Damn. Okay. Okay. I'm going to okay. Dear Shella, I would like to give you some information about an upcoming event, the Feast of the Winter Star. It's time for the community to come together and think back on all the good fortune we've had this year. A favorite tradition is the secret gift exchange, where everyone in town is randomly assigned to someone else. On the day of the festival, everyone brings a gift to their secret friend and surprises them with something special. This year, your secret friend is... If it's Clint, I'm ending the stream. Mayor Lewis! Oh no, Pierre. Oh god, it's... Ah! Uh, it's all bad. Oh no. Pierre, really? What's that guy even like? Parsnips? Alright, uh... That was a roller coaster and it was all downhill, honestly. Anyone but Mary Lewis. <laughs> yeah, it's Pierre. What should I give Pierre? Garbage? I could do that. All I know is that he likes calamari. I don't think I have calamari yet. How do I get calamari? Because your girl has roe. None of it's turning into calamari, though. Which one of these turns into calamari? If Clunt gives me my gift, I'm going to throw it in the trash. Squid? Oh, you make it with a squid. Oh, I'm thinking of... What am I thinking of? I'm thinking of fish... Like, the fish eggs. Caviar. That's what I was thinking of. Sturgeon row. Okay. Yeah, I'm not crazy. I had it in my head. I was thinking of caviar. Sorry. Okay, how are you? How are you doing? Okay, little tree's growing. Well, I don't think I want to make caviar. I mean, calamari. Or Pierre. Is there anything else he likes? There's got to be something else. There's got to be something else. He likes daffodils and dandelions. Well, I think I have a couple of those. He loves the price catalog. <laughs> Wait, you can give him the price catalog? Is that real? Rabbit's foot. Hmm. Oh, yeah, I can go check back at the raccoon. Oh, sorry. Wait, one, two. Are you guys clothed yet? Okay, no wool. It's fine. Have I pet everybody? Oh my god. I'm a disaster. I haven't pet Barbara. I'm sorry, Barbara. Anyone else? Okay, no. I do not still have my golden pumpkin. I turned that into a uh, outfit, I think. It was very important to me to be fashionable. So. Oh, I have a pearl, but is he worth that? Okay, I love that my ducks are giving me duck feathers, but also I need to have eggs for Gus. So it also feels a little bit like rude of them to be doing that right now. I need eggs. No. I'm not a milk drinker. There we go. Egg strike. Yeah, for real. Pearls, rabbit's foots, and the new tea from the prize machine are all universal loves that would work for him. I don't know if he's worth that, though. I think I'm just going to give him a dandelion. Look. 
I ain't trying to be friends with Pierre. If it happens, it happens. He's really, like, not my fave. In fact, he's very low on my list. I'm gonna give him a literal weed. It will be fine. He'll love it. Made it to floor 100! Let's go! Give him whatever you pick up that day. Yeah, like, on the way to the festival, whatever I find can go to him. Sound like a plan? Okay, um, real talk, though. I need to buy 100 wheat flour. Can I afford that today is the super fun, exciting question. Also, I need to go cut down some trees. Hi, little raccoon friend. Do you have anything to tell me? Did you find a wife? Now maybe I find wife. Okay. He's still looking for a wife. I wish him good luck, you know? Must be rough out there in the raccoon streets. It's 10k to buy the wheat flour? Okay. Yeah, I can just sell some cheese. And then I want to buy a... A deluxe coop, but I believe that will be 25,000 gold, which I do not have on hand right now. I could liquidate some of my assets, but I don't think I will. I'm not in that big of a rush for it, so I will just wait. I guess they're getting married. I gave him a fish and he said he's going to go find a wife. That was like his plan of action there. I've been on raccoon Tinder. I bet it's pretty trashy. The raccoon that was in the greenhouse? Um, I don't know if it was in the greenhouse. There was like a big storm. And then one one day I went and I looked and it knocked over the giant tree and there's a raccoon that moved in. You know? Ooh, good luck, Beth. I haven't played with Riverside yet. It looks really fun though. Oh, did we? I don't know. Did we see one run out of the greenhouse when it was renovated? I can't remember. A lot of things have been happening, so like there's a there's a high chance that I've forgotten something. Who knows? Okay, I probably have enough wood. So I'm gonna go to Pierre's with a capital B and sell some of my cheese and buy a hundred wheat flour and go finish the friendship bundle, the friendship section of the community center. And then all, all that I will have left is the fish. So. Oh, the tree can't fall until the greenhouse is done. That makes sense. I love you. Oh, Missy Lou, thank you so much. That's so sweet. Love you too. Thank you for the resub. Thanking you. Oh, yeah, I hope over a thousand wood. Definitely some overkill in there. Hi, Queen Remy. Thank you for the 13 months. I super appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay. Um, yeah, I'll just sell half of my cheese. It's whatever. And then I need to bring my stuff over there. I'll just bring literally everything. I might even have enough eggs to make up for the day that I sold them. Or, sorry, not sold them, but turned them into mayonnaise. <laughs> Uh, you can check my mods. There's a there's a list pinned at the top of my chat. If you would like to see the fishing mod I'm using. It includes a link. Catfish. That seems kind of hard. I don't know if I can do that. Isn't catfish like very specific? Okay. Oh my gosh. 100 wheat flour. What a waste of money. So annoying. Not pleased that I have this bundle. 
Oh, that's a cute nickname. Rainy days. Yeah, and it's like snowing, so I don't even know if I could do that right now. Oh no, I have exactly 10 eggs. Okay. And then, there we go. No, they fell in the water. Oh no, that sucks. I'm sorry. Okay, so this bundle will give me friendship with everyone. So get ready for a bunch of cutscenes. Because we're going to have a bunch of them now. Yeah, I would probably need a rain totem. I don't think I have one of those right now. Tis unfortunate, but tis how it is. There we go. Okay. Do your little dance, buddy. Show it off. Uh, yeah, I have a, a separate chest that I was keeping eggs for Gus, because I had two quests at once that required eggs, so. Don't worry. It is all under control, I think. I don't know. I like to say I have things under control, but who knows if I actually do. Who knows? I am a little bit mad at Pastella for not even trying to finish the fishing bundle. So. We all shake our fists and yell at her. She sucks. Oh no, I'm sorry, Aqua Gamer. Do I have the recipe for a rain totem? Oh yeah, I just got it. Oh, I do not have truffle oil. That is an ingredient I'm missing. I have pigs, but they literally, they don't go outside in the winter. So I can't get truffles until, you know, later, which is quite unfortunate for me, isn't it? Hate that for me. Oh my gosh, hi, cold hearted. Thanks for stopping in to the live streams. It's nice to meet you. Thank you for, for stopping by. Coming to the lives. Okay, um, what else can I do? I, could, I guess I'll just go cut down more trees. Might as well. I kind of like that tree there, though. I think my plan in the future is to, like, have this area be for animals around this little pond here. I always wait for year two to do the fishing bundle. Yeah, it's just, it's a lot. Like, completing the community center is exciting and everything, but... Oh my god, I got my second Jack B. Nimble, Jack B. Thick book. Am I already level 10, though? Combat? No, I'm not. I'm almost max level and everything, though. That's kind of exciting. Oh, it's funny. It's Pierre's birthday today, and I'm ignoring it. Haha. <laughs> Get wrecked. I'm excited. Oh, yeah, I'm thick. I, I'm not going to be thick again, though. I'll be okay. But I, I read that book when I got it the first time, and it made me thick. Just like Jack. Yeah, I want them to be able to swim, too. I think that they can swim in the original coop, like, in the waterfall area, but I would still like to be able to, like, have a spot for them to swim. You forgot to catch a pufferfish, but you managed to find it in the traveling cart. Nice. I have the, um, three worked bundles, so it's, like randomized um so it is a little bit harder to like plan things you know because you don't know what you're gonna get oh that was sad just trying to clear a path over here oh got it yeah there's just not much space that makes sense oh thank you ellie thank you I don't know why, but I'm like so anxious right now. 
I'm trying to chill and just have fun on Stardew Valley. Maybe my coffee will help. Coffee usually calms me down. Thanks, ADHD. Hello, hyperfixation. I mean, I feel like a lot of us here have kind of given given into the hyperfixation. So join us, thrive. I don't know if the vanilla bundles are necessarily easier, but it's like if you know what they are, you can kind of plan in, in advance for them. And that makes it easier, if that makes sense. Like, I'm not here. Oh, that's so weird. I wonder who said that. So weird. I'm just hearing voices. Haha. -ha. Crazy. Oh my gosh, yeah. I heard that there's tornadoes hitting people today. I hope everyone is staying safe. Um, sheltering, all that good stuff. Paying attention to weather warnings. Just be careful out there. All right, I will just give that to the bookseller, I guess. Jack be nimble, Jack be thick. I should really put all of my extra books in the same chest so I'm ready. I don't know if the bookseller is coming again this year. So we'll find out. Is there one in here? Yeah, there's one in here. There's still so many books that I haven't gotten, so the fact that I'm getting, like, repeats is kind of crazy. I guess for now, I will- I'll just put them in here. Or maybe- maybe in here. Yeah, that's good. There's a blizzard coming to you on Thursday? Oh my gosh. Crazy weather everywhere. Not ideal. Thank you for reigniting my Stardew obsession. You are literally so welcome, pirate. <laughs> Thank you for the resub. Oh. oh my goodness. I'm on Tornado Watch. I'm watching stream to calm my nerves. I hate tornado season. Yeah, I bet. It's really nerve wracking. I don't have to deal with it that much now that I live in Minnesota, but when I lived in Dallas, it was always a thing. Um, but yeah, if any of you are here, and on Tornado Watch 07. Oh, it wasn't Pierre's birthday yesterday, so this must just mean I guess he's my Winterfest gift, whatever it's called. I keep calling it Winterfest. That's it. That's what it is in The Sims. Okay, spirits are in a bad mood today. It's gonna be a beautiful summer summer day tomorrow. Okay, there we go. I have mail. Whoa! Dear Shella, everyone around town has been talking about your great generosity lately. Apparently packages have been appearing in people's houses containing the items they've hissed about use about on the community center bulletin. And the packages are all addressed from your farm. Thanks for going out of your way to do something like that. All of us in town are delighted. You're welcome, Mayor Lewis. It's just who I am. Kind and generous. Definitely not in it for any other reason. No ulterior motives here. That one. Yeah, when is the eclipse happening? Isn't it on, like, the 16th? You're in Ohio? Oh, gosh, yeah. Stay safe. The 8th? Oh. Dun, 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 dun. I don't think Minnesota has a great view of the eclipse, to be honest with you. I think we're getting like a half moon. That's exciting, though. Should I come to Ohio? Oh my god, hey! Uh, good morning, Miss Shella. I came by to ask you a favor, since you're such a kind neighbor. You see, I'm trying to train my goats to say hello, but they simply won't pay attention to me unless I have their favorite treat. Cave carrots. So, since I'm scared of the mines, I thought, well, maybe you'd bring me a cave carrot when you have the chance. There's no pressure, but if you want to, just swing by my house between 9 and 5. I like Marnie's winter outfit. I think she looks so pretty. Okay, I think I do have cave carrots, so I could probably do that. I could stop by her house before I go 
to the traveling merchant today. Oh, and I think we get wool today. You know what that means. It's clothes day. I can make two new clothes. Best day of the week. Oh, the day when my sheep grow their wool back. <gasps> Lilo, thank you so much for the resub for 10 months. Welcome back. Thank you, thank you. Thank you for the coffee. I know, she's so cute in the winter. Yeah, I'm getting a partial eclipse. Apparently everyone's going to Niagara Falls to watch the eclipse. Ooh, is it going over Niagara in totality? Because that would be a really good, like, a really cool photo. That is so cool. A lot of people are coming to my city to watch it. I love that. Yeah, I think if I, if I live, if I live, or if I went to my parents' house, I'd be able to see it. Because they're in Texas. So. I would have seen it if I was still living there. 60 to 80 coverage at peak. Okay. Not bad. NASA announced Niagara would be the best place in North America to watch it. That's iconic. That's like so dramatic of the eclipse to do that. She was like, this will be my moment. I can't wait to see the pictures. There we go. Saving my eggs. How many eggs do I need? 24. All right. Still got a bunch that I need to save up. And then I accidentally sold all of my eggs on one day, so it's going to take me an extra day to do it. Okay, how much money do I need for, not this, for a deluxe coop? Let's find out. Twenty thousand. Okay, I mean, I could get it today if I really wanted to. But I'm not in a rush, so I'll let it happen naturally. Just let me cook for a little bit. Ooh, that's exciting. The moon said you will revolve around me for a change, right? The city of Niagara announced a state of emergency because too many people are going. Really? That's kind of scary. I have a really, like... I'm always scared about stuff like that. I don't do well in crowded public places, but I really hope nobody gets hurt or does anything too dangerous because it's Niagara Falls is freaking huge and it's so dangerous. Like, you know, like going over the falls or something like, haha, I'm going to go. I'm going to watch it on literally the waterfall. Like, no, don't don't get in a boat like that's that's scary. That is really scary. Yeah. Okay, let me give um, Marnie a cave carrot. Yeah, just don't be dumb. Oh! Hi, Marnie. Oh, you brought the cave carrot. Thank you so much, Miss Shella. You're welcome. This looks great. I almost want to eat it myself. Almost. Okay, that makes literally one of us. Sorry, no offense. Hope it wasn't too much trouble. I really do appreciate it. Yikes. Okay. And then I did get my pickaxe back, so that's kind of exciting. Hello, do you have a fish I need? Oh, carp. I think I might actually need that fish. Right? Oh my god! Traveling merchant. Thank you. 
That's the last fish I need of that one bundle. And I'm going to buy that house plant because it's cute. And I like it. Should I spend a thousand on one wood? Thoughts? Also, apple being sold. That's kind of crazy. Let's go. Hi, Mr. Raccoon. How are you doing? Okay, still looking for a wife. Good luck. Good luck with that. Yeah, that's crazy. I feel bad for small towns. If you're in that situation, stay safe. I actually, I already have an apple tree, so I already got the, the apples I needed for my bundle. Thankfully. That's such a cute little cactus. I like it. All right, let me go turn my carp in, and then I'm going to go pick up my... Um, I'm going to go pick up my pickaxe. I'm going to actually have Clunt open my geodes while I'm there. Yeah. Oh, hi, Gooby! We have a visitor. <laughs> Do you think Mr. Raccoon's asking me to marry them? I decline, politely. Too much fur. I'm seriously considering upgrading my Stardew house purely so I can fit all my house plants. <laughs> Iconic. Hello, ladies. Beautiful day. It's literally snowing. You are not saying this right now, Morris. Afternoon, Morris. Ah, oh, Morris. Greeting the townsfolk? Aha, I am. On a day as glorious as this one, how could I not? Keep up the good work, Mayor. Uh, thanks, Morris. A beautiful day it is. It's, he's really trying to sell this. It's snowing. Are you trying to gaslight yourself into believing this? Not Pierre from the alleyway. Ah, Pierre, I truly hope you're well on this beautiful day. Oh. Okay, Pierre. Pierre hates him. Hello, Shella. Fancy meeting you by Joja Mart. Are you enjoying the beautiful weather today? Why are you so happy? The president of Joja Corp is impressed with my work in the valley. Finally, I have been recognized by the higher-ups. I am due a promotion and a raise for my collective efforts furthering the Joja family. The condominium I have had my eye on is finally within my grasp. Sounds like a well-deserved promotion. I have worked many days and nights to secure this advancement for my career. The fruits of my labor are finally paying off. Speak to me at Jojamart. I'll give you a discount in advance. Okay. Bye, Morris. I'm just gonna go turn in my carp. What did I tell you guys? Lots of cutscenes coming up because we completed the friendship bundle, which means a lot of people are more friendly with me. Maybe George will send me his spicy eel recipe. Push him in the river. Oh my god. I'm not here to commit a murder. Not today. That was yesterday, chat. That was yesterday. Uh, dress spinner. Here we go. Thank you. Another cutscene? Nope, okay. Time to go to Clunt. Thank you in advance. I don't want to dance. Na, 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 na. Morris Bootlicker Supreme. <laughs> what does it mean you being neurodivergent? Uh, neurodivergent is whenever you are under the umbrella of uh, a disability such as autism, ADHD, bipolar disorder. There's a lot of them. I would definitely recommend um, looking more into it online and reading up about it if you're curious. But for me, it's ADHD and autism.
Those are just... Oh, six iridium! Clunt, oh my god, you just made my whole day. That is crazy, girl. Oh, and I don't think I had that one. Star shards. Exciting. <laughs> All right. Let me go ahead and uh, turn these in. Yeah, I'm ADHD. That's just how I identify. Okay. Um, for the rest of the day, what should I do? I could go to the mines, but I feel like that's kind of a waste of my time. Maybe I'll go to the hidden forest and cut down some hardwood. Because I, I would really like to get a horse soon. Oh my gosh, Vibrant Violet! Thank you for the first time sub! Using your prime chat, you know what that means. Enjoy your emotes and your ad free viewing. But most importantly of all, enjoy your new smile! Thank you! Yeah. Neurodivergent is the opposite of neurotypical. Hope that helps. <laughs> That's so vague. All right, let me go ahead and turn these in at home. I love having coffee. I forget. I need the triple shot espresso recipe, but I don't remember where to get it. Is that the one that you can buy from the Star Drop Saloon? Because I will buy that. I love going fast. Buy it from Gus. Does he sell it like every day? How do I make a big chest? Wood, copper bar? Yeah. I'm gonna make some big chests. Two of them. One of them will be here. Boom. Big mining chest. Yeah. I know. Honestly, a lot of the games we play it just vibe with the neurodivergent community. So. I don't know. I feel like this chat is very, like, queer and neurodivergent. I don't know. Just a speculation. According to my observations. Just what I've noticed about us. Okay, maybe I should use a big chest for this one. This is produce. So now I have a chest, two more chests. Um, I guess I'll put my chests in a chest for now. Until I need them. Hi! You have a toddler! Woohoo! Oh no, we have a toddler. Two years, let's go. <laughs> Thank you for the two year resub. Enjoy your galaxy badge. I thought you were saying like IRL you have a toddler and I was like that's exciting kind of maybe not actually though because I, I hear toddlers are a little bit scary to deal with but good for you but <laughs> now I know <laughs> now I know what you were saying <laughs> congrats I think question mark question mark neurodivergent people tend to flock together it's true I guess like you guys are are here and you you stick around probably because you you get good vibes is what i'm assuming like i don't want to put words into your mouths but you probably get like the vibes you know the accepted vibes i'm not i need to drink there we go no, you're actually my enemy. Sorry. Oh, okay, okay. Oof, I was worried there for a second. I hate making friends. My nightmare. <laughs> oh my gosh. Let's go get some hardwood. After a day of long among us, you'd think that I've already had enough of that, but... Nope. Turns out I need more hardwood. Bearberry. Is this from Expanded? That's got to be expanded. I feel like I've never seen that before. 
In my last job, my ADHD friend left and I was so lost. That's hard. Yeah, that's true. Honestly, and this is no, like, there's nothing wrong with people's streams that are like this. This is just something that I personally can't handle is when people have like super loud, super long, super like intense alerts or just like so much energy that it's like a little bit overwhelming and overstimulating for me. Like I personally cannot be in a stream like that for too long because if I want to like do something at the same time as watching the stream, I get very overstimulated. And that's nothing wrong. Like there's nothing wrong with that. It's just not catering towards my needs. So it is what it is. Oh my God, I should give my sweet berry to Master Cannoli. I forgot. Should I put that on my thing, my list to do tomorrow? Yeah, some streams are just way too much and that's okay. I like how calm this stream is. Yeah, we keep it calm. Pretty much every day except for Among Us Day, I would say is a sensory friendly stream. On Among Us Day, we like to cosplay as neurotypical. We like to mask for a day. That makes me happy, Indy. Yeah. I get it. Yeah, they're very overstimulating. Okay, I don't know what these bear berries are from. Even the chaos is calm. <laughs> um. Thank you, pirate. Have you seen the mod that mutes colors? Is it? Okay, so to my understanding, those mods are not... Because I want that. I want to have a different color palette in the game. But I think a couple, like, I haven't found one that's updated for Stardew Valley Expanded. For 1.6. Because, like, I would love to have one. I, I would love to have a more, like, desaturated vibe but all of the ones i've looked into are not like compatible with stardew valley expanded update so i just haven't so if you guys like have one that works maybe if you don't mind doing me a favor and posting a link to it in the stardew channel so i can look at it and find one that i like but just keep in mind they have to be compatible with expanded. Otherwise, I will not use it. But I have been looking for recolors. And I, I want something that's like, just like a little bit more earthy or desaturated. I don't know the difference between a reshade and a recolor, to be honest with you. I'm not smart. I'm really dumb. Ooh, butterfly bow! Mine. Blue bow is my new favorite bow from Hat Mouse. Yeah, if you guys can like post them um, in the Discord, that would help. Because I will not be taking any formal mod suggestions at this time. My brain is on gaming mode right now not retaining mode so anything you suggest at this time will literally evaporate from my brain i'll be like wait what 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 did, what did they say again they had a great suggestion i forgot it's gone it's already gone lost in the sauce you're wearing a bow tie lulu wow is that your editor outfit? Formal attire? So true. Okay. Okay, I got 30 hardwood from the secret woods today. That is pretty slay. Nice work. I'm a formal mod ready for formal formal mod suggestions. Oh. See, you make really good jokes, but they just don't work for me because I can't remember what I said five seconds ago. 
It's not your fault. I'm just a goldfish. Hi, Rayla. Hi, Rayla. My cats come in and say hi to me sometimes. Yeah, they're extra funny when you explain them. How many cats do I have? Two. Two of them. Cats are better in pairs. Okay. Spirits are very happy today. Ooh. I might be yearning for the mines. It's Clunt? Well, I know a couple of recipes. I thought I'd send you one. Maybe it'll help you mine more ore or something. Take care. LG soup. Shella, this recipe of mine won first place in a cooking competition. I hope you like it. Fried calamari. Dear Shella, nothing is more satisfying than cooking with fresh vegetables from your own garden. Parsnip soup. Hey kid, here's the recipe for a little treat my pappy used to make. Cook it slow. Okay, fried mushroom. I need spicy eel. Ooh, sashimi. That's a good one. Kale broth from Marnie. Chowda from Willy. Oh. Thank you, Linus. What level of friendship do I need with George to get him to cough up the spicy eel recipe? What level? I need to know. <laughs> Seven? One, two, three, four, five. Oh! When I get to springtime, I'm gonna give him so many leaks, he's not gonna know what to do with himself. Ooh, fish! Which one is that? A perch. I don't think I need that one. Oh my gosh, welcome in, wild chick! Happy to help! Happy to help. We have good stardew knowledge here if you have any questions. A repertoire of knowledge. We're kind of like a hive mind, if you think about it. Like, you can access the archives of all of our gaming knowledge. Just like an illithid hive mind. Love that. Kind of slay. Okay. Lots of recipes, though. Because that's, uh, I finished the, uh, bundle for friendships. There we go. You're a proud cat lady, me too. I hope my dinosaur egg hatches soon. I keep forgetting it's there. One day I'm gonna wake up and there's gonna be a dinosaur and I'm gonna be like, hello. I forgot about you. It's gonna be so good. Oh, okay, yeah, What? that's a good question, chat. How do you organize your chests? I go based off of vibes. Like, if I feel like items should go together, I put them together. Wait, I'm missing a milk. There we go. You silly. Have I pet everybody? And I like to keep my foraging separate from my, uh... Props. Wait, where's Colby? Okay, now I've pet everybody. Cannot wait to get an auto petter one day. You ordered the latest Stardew Valley guidebook. I literally love that for you. I think I might want to order it too, just to have it. Even though I don't like actively need it. I think it's just so fun to have like gaming guidebooks. There's something about it. That brings me back to like <laughs> my childhood. Because obviously I can just Google it, but like, yeah, there's an auto petter. Auto petter and an auto collector too. There we go. Oh my god, early ancient speed seed. That's really lucky. Congrats. Love that for you. Can I dry coffee beans out? 
Now this is something I'm curious about. Thank you. Apparently you can't dehydrate coffee seeds. I guess that makes sense. All right, everybody. Coffee beans. Okay. Foraging. Fishing. I might have to change my fishing to fish. And, like, lures and stuff. I might have to further separate them eventually. Because my chest is almost full already. It's a big chest. Diamond. Quest eggs. Alright, how many eggs do I need left? So there's a chance I could get it tomorrow, but I think it might take me two more days to complete that one. Oh, uh, cheese. There we go. I do have two cloth. Should I see what a powder melon makes? I want to see what a powder melon and a duck feather makes when it comes to uh, making clothes. Oh, yeah. We actually, if you're looking for a group chat to discuss stuff like this, we have a Discord channel for Stardew Valley. Lime green striped shirt. Interesting. Oh, I'll make white pants. You know what? Sure. I could use some white pants. I actually feel like white pants would look nicer with, like, the outfit I'm going for. Let me, let me try to fix it here. Da -da 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 -da. Da -da 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 -da. Oh, let me take my shirt off and then go put the fake one on. I'll put this in here. Sashimi is really easy to make. Yeah, dust sprites can drop coffee beans too. There we go. It looks better with white pants in my opinion. I do want a white skirt, but I haven't discovered the skirt recipe yet. So, okay, I think today I'm gonna go to the mines. I think we're gonna do a, we're gonna do a run. So I'm gonna get my bombs. I need to make more bombs. I don't have as much iron as I would like. So I need to get lots of iron in the mines. And then I'm going to bring cheese instead of mayonnaise. And then I'm going to grab a spicy eel. And call it good. All right, ready? It's mining time. We're yarning. We haven't gone to the mines at all today, so this is important for me. Yeah, we're romancing Sophia from Stardew Valley Expanded. Um, just joined Discord and I'm slowly figuring out how Discord works. It can be really confusing if you've never used Discord before. So if you ever need any help, um, don't be afraid to ask. The mods are very helpful, um, and there's also some pretty uh, experienced chatting chatters that can be of use as well. As well. Um, let me see what shirt you're selling today. Do I want it? No, I don't. I like those uh, all sconces though. Love to yearn. New Sims pack. The Sims 4 love to yearn. Lots of coconuts out here, oh my gosh. Here we go. How far can I go? I have a golden pickaxe now, so. All right, let me quickly eat this. We're just going to go as far as fast and as furious as possible. Shoot. I'm 
I'm a little disappointed that I have this level. Get me out of here. This is so unlucky, getting this type of level. I think this type of level uh, people usually use stairs for, but I have not been making stairs yet. I still have things I want to buy. Unlucky. Yeah, definitely stairs. Ooh, okay, got a ladder. This is another level that I would use stairs on if I could. Hole! Oh! oh my god. We get some uh, holes manifested. You guys mind manifesting some holes for me? We need some diamond. Hey! Hey! No, no, no. We do not. No, ma'am. They're fighting. <laughs> oh my god. Here we go. I'm using so many bombs right now. Here we go. Ladder. I just need more iron. I'm gonna get both of those. There we go. I wish that the music was playing. Uh, this is the Skull Caverns. I'm at level 11 right now. It's like a special cave in the desert. So it's different than the regular caverns. Hole! We did it! Please, big hole. Only three? Come on. Ooh, hole. Give me spicy eel, come on. Dang it. Jump in. Seven levels. Oh god, my my ankles. Has anyone ever like died in the mines from the hole damage? Oh, oh, oh my god. You have? That's so sad. The farthest I've ever fallen is 15 floors. I don't know if there's like an actual like max or something. But 15 floors was kind of crazy. We are left with one HP left once. Oh my god. That's so scary. Oh, can you not actually die from the hole? Not this level, please. Not this level, dude. I don't want to be here. Hole! Five levels. Let's go. Oh, there, there's another hole. Oh my god, chat. It's working. Hole! Nine levels. Let's go. Okay, that I'm actually fine. Ah, ah, panic. Spicy eel! Whoa. Found you. Give me my iridium. A ladder. There's iron over here, though. I feel like I should grab the iron. For my bombs. Hi, Zoe. How are you? <sighs> Only if there's a monster waiting below. That would be so unlucky. Falling, like, directly onto a monster. 
That would happen to me, though. Oh, that's actually Iridium. I thought it was gonna be a crab. You just got home from work? Welcome home. I'm doing good. Just yearning for the mines, as usual. Nothing new here. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Two holes. Oh my god. Which hole do I go in? Top or bottom? There's two. Will they lead to the same place, do you think? Top? Okay. Yeah, skull, aver skull caverns are going okay. How big? Five levels? Okay. Literally mid. Ooh, I want this. There we go. It's hard to decide. I feel like they both go to the same place, though. What's for dinner, Procrastinating? Crafting? Hole! Five levels. 51. 53 is my record for uh, Skull Caverns without stairs in this save file, so... We're almost beating that. We're getting really good luck today. Oh shoot, this is wasting my time. This floor is not ideal. Oh, that's lucky, Bunny. Oh my gosh. That is crazy lucky. Seriously? No hole? Oh my god. Sorry, it's a little hard for me to look at chat through this. I don't want to use all my bombs in one spot. Eh. Please! Please! Okay, there we go. I just want to beat my record. I'm on 52. One more floor and I will be tied with my record for this save file. Come on, there's like no good place for a bomb. Oh, that's so annoying. Oh, such a waste of time. My spicy eel is about to wear off too. I might just eat another one. I have another one at home, so I'm gonna eat one. I'm gonna drink a coffee. There we go. Someone in chat suggested um, for like really attempting a run in Skull Caverns, setting up a tent in the desert overnight. So that way you can like start at 6 a.m. Yeah, spicy eel makes you lucky. It's my whole thing. That's why I have lava eels on my farm is because I want them to, um, shoot. I want to be able to use them to make more spicy eel. Okay, I'm tied with my record. Oh god, you're big. And scary. Goodbye. Woohoo! <gasps> Red cowboy hat? This is the best day of my life. <laughs> Every time I get something new, I say that. Yay! How? Yes, that is true. I could buy them in the desert if I run out. That is my secondary strategy. Secondary strategy. Okay, there's a lot of um, ghosts here. Um, I'm in danger. Oh, I'm in danger. Ooh, okay. So here's what's gonna... Ah! 
Thank goodness. Okay, let's just do a bomb right here. Bomb right here. Oh my goodness. Scary. I can wear that with my flannel shirt. Oh my god, true. It's a red flannel. Okay, this is my last bomb, but I might be able to make some more. With what I got on me. Miner's tree as well. Okay, I have 14 more bombs. Don't worry, everyone. I'm gonna get this iron. It's like, I need this to make bombs, so I might as well. There we go. Okay, down we go. Down, down, down by the river. Here we go. Really? Fifty-eight, by the way. Haha, uh -huh, miss me. Loser. Die. Die, die. Die. Owie! Not the Iridium bats. Please! I'm just- I'm just a girl! God, oh my god, oh my god. Stop! Leave me alone. I'm just a girl. They do so much damage. <laughs> I sang it and now you want to play Boulder's Gate 3? Sorry. Sorry. Okay, here we go. I have that song on my Spotify. <laughs> Does anyone else have like gaming music on their Spotify playlist? Cause like, <laughs> that's what I do. Sometimes I'll have like a very specific like game soundtrack where I'm just like, this is the vibe. Oh my God, I'm flopping hard. Find, I need to find the hole. There it is. Okay, I'm just gonna bomb myself. It's fine. I'll just eat some cheese. Tis but a scratch. Wait, what am I doing? Bomb. Ah. Bomb them. Okay, I'm getting tired. What is that? I think I want that. Energy supplements. Okay. All right. I want this ruby. Hard focusing. I want all of that gold. I want this. I'm going out with a bang. Literally. Oh shoot, I forgot you turn into babies. Oh my God. Sorry. Okay. Should I just die in here? What if I just die in here? Actually, I'm afraid to lose my stuff. Oh! I jumped. I shouldn't have done that. Okay, I'm leaving. I have an hour to get home. Yeah, I should make a, a warp totem. That'd be smart of me. Okay. I don't want to lose anything in my inventory. There's a chance I could lose a thousand or I could lose like nine things in my inventory, which is like not a vibe. Or is that only if you die? Oh, if I'm just late, I only lose a thousand gold. Oh, oh, I have a warp totem in my inventory. I knew that I just wanted to save it for later. I was just, you know, it just wasn't the time. It's my strategy. You guys, pro it's probably too big brain for you to understand. It's just, it's okay. You don't, it's just my, um, my way of going about things. So.
it's fine, you know. I wouldn't expect you guys to understand. I didn't realize. Dang it. This is why I should read chat. Okay, it's fine. Everything's fine. I'm okay. We're okay. Everything's okay. I got a cowboy hat. I literally could not be more thrilled. Ah! Ah! Let me out! Okay, good night. Pro gamer strat, exactly. That's all it is. I don't expect you guys to understand. Me being the pro gamer I am and all. <laughs> that was pretty good. How? Wait, what floor did I get to? It was 60 something. Was it 69 or am I just making that up? We could we could go back and look in the VOD. Good night, Kathleen. Thanks for hanging out. It was 67. Oh my god, I flopped. If I would have used the warp totem, I could have made it to 69. <sighs> Big time flop. Big time flop. I'm sorry, everyone. I understand if this is where you have to unfollow me. I get it. I wouldn't expect anything less. All right, pumpkin pie. Ding! Literally soiled it, literally. Oh, thanks, Caroline. Oh my gosh, Britch Snowski. Thank you for the resub for six months. I appreciate it. Okay, Robin needs some hardwood. 10 pieces of hardwood. I guess I can spare 10 pieces of hardwood. For you, Robin. Oh good, an escape. Lulu, I thought you loved hanging out with me. I'll grab the food. <laughs> I'll grab the food, I'll start the car. Are you guys really leaving? Ooh. My mods don't even like me. Oh shoot, I need my watering can. That's what I wanted you to think? Oh. Well, you succeeded. Do I like the mods? No, of course not. No, no, no. This is a very one-sided relationship. Okay, here we go. Oh, it's gonna be forever till I'm rich again. I'm sad. I spent all my money. What did I even spend it on? It was on those stupid wheat flowers. I hope you're happy, community center. All right. Uh-oh, I must be out of grass. The mods have escaped the shed. No, they haven't. Did I just cut off like their their hair? Is that what just happened? It was like just the top part of their hair disappeared. That's rough. <gasps> ah! It's happening. A new baby lizard hatched. <gasps> oh, why is its name Bakio? Are you trying to say that? Why would... It hates me already. Not Fakio. Fakio, Fakio. What should we name it? Wait, captions are saying that? Oh my god, my captions are saying that? Quickly, quickly, say something else. Spam. 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 Spam, spam, spam. <laughs> I'm sorry if you have captions on. <laughs> spam, 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 spam. <laughs> oh, 
Ooh, Littlefoot's fun. They're gone? Okay. Mm. What should I say? <laughs> Name it Spam. <laughs> hmm. Okay, is he going to be a purple dinosaur? Should I just name him Barney? Because I, I, I said it so that the, they might be purple. I don't know. People like Reptar. I can do Reptar. Rar and Gnar? Wait, that's funny. I can always rename. Can you rename them? I tried to rename one once and it didn't let me. You can rename? Okay, I'll name it Barney and see what happens. Are you purple? <gasps> it is purple! Look! It's my purple dinosaur! Wait, I wanna see you turn sideways. Oh my god, he's so cute! Look at the little baby! <laughs> I'm so happy right now. That's so cute. The chickens are probably like, who's this guy? Get a load of him. What a weirdo. I'm literally so happy. So now, I will get my dinosaur eggs. They don't eat the chickens, do they? Well, I guess we'll find out. I haven't pet my cat yet. I do need to go get more grass. The chickens get to meet their ancestor. Literally, yeah, they came from dinosaurs. So exciting. Wow. When you think of it that way. Oh, do you have a dragon mod, Glogu? I would download a dragon mod. I would, 10 out of 10. I really don't wanna run out of pay. I posted it in the Discord, okay, thanks. If I open my game next time we play and I have dragons, don't worry about it. Just don't even worry about it. Oh, it was right after the update, okay. Okay, that's fine. Oh, does it like replace um, mobs with dragons though? Cause I wouldn't want that if it's just like a, a reskin of like cows or something. Scythe, all of that. No, it's a whole new mod. Oh. Ooh, that's exciting then. Okay, mushrooms. Mushroom cave is like the least exciting thing on my farm. Oh, the traveling merchant's in town today. I should go see if they have a fish that I need. Yeah, I'm thinking of setting up barns like here. I might end up moving the greenhouse from this location. This might not be where her permanent resting place is. Um, and that's okay, because I might be like, instead of having the barn here, I might move it down there eventually. All right, let me feed you guys. Sorry. I'm sorry about that. So sorry. There we go. You have your cows still. Well, that's exciting. Modding Stardew Valley is like a lifestyle. And I, I'm liking it a lot. I've always, like, 
seeing people mod Stardew Valley and I'm like, that could never be me, it's too intense. But now here I am, a living example of giving in to peer pressure and doing it, you know? And I've never been happier. <laughs> uh, wait, you're not supposed to be in here. What are you doing in here? What should I turn into clothes? I have two things I can make today. Any requests for any items that I have that I should turn into clothes? How is your modding inspo? You're so welcome. Void essence? We could do void essence. Cheese clothes? I could turn a cheese into clothes. Should I do goat cheese or regular cheese? I think I did do a purple mushroom. I don't remember though. I literally got the animal reskins because of you. You're welcome. I guess we could start with regular cheese and then do goat cheese the next time. All right, Void Essence. Oh, I've already done that. Cheese. It's a mouse? <laughs> that is so cute. Okay, I need something other than Void Essence. I've already done that. I could be a rat. Mayo? Have I done trash? I haven't done trash. I'll do a mayonnaise. I saw that as a request earlier too. Oh, wait, that's actually really cute. It's like a light blue cloud shirt. Now, hold on a second. That's kind of a sleigh. Cute. I like that one. Okay, that was exciting. I wonder, yeah, I wonder if Milk would give me a cow shirt. That's interesting. We'll have to see. Okay, um... I think today I'm going to... Okay. I was cooking. Yeah, we're gonna... We're gonna upgrade my hoe. I think, before my axe. Okay, yeah. And then... I guess I'll go bring Robin 10 pieces of a hardwood while those are cooking. BRB! A mayo molly. <laughs> Yeah, people were saying that it was updated. As long as it has Stardew Valley expanded, I I will probably download that um that that recolor. I've never done that before though. I would have to tell Violet though, because we're gonna be playing together tomorrow. So anything I have, she has like a mod folder specifically for playing with me. Hi Robin. Oh sorry, what? I'm here to give you my hardwood. Woohoo! You're welcome. And then I have to go put 24 eggs in Gus's fridge, but um, I don't think I can do that yet because I don't think I have 24 eggs. Is there anything else I want? I'm like really poor right now. I guess I could buy a plasma TV, but like, I don't know. Kind of just waiting. It's hard to make money consistently in winter. I recommend sending her a copy of your mod folder. Yeah, that's what I've been doing. Hey, 
Hey, Eel Cursor, thank you for the 13 months. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. Oh, yeah, I could give George and Sophia gifts today. I should do that. Don't watch me. Don't watch me. Don't look at me. Close your eyes. Oh, you know what happened that I literally forgot? I, I unlocked the sewer, but I never went in it. Maybe I should do that today. Oh, it's locked. I saw someone go in there, though. How do I get in there? It's freezing today. I don't want Sophia to see me dig in the trash. What the heck? I saw Marlin go in there. Should I go talk to Marlin about it? I don't see expanded in the recolor page, so I don't think it has it. Oh, dang it. That is unfortunate. I have to go to the sewer gate first. Okay. Well, I don't have the key from Gunther, but chat was telling me that Gunther isn't the one that gives you the key today. Or in, in expanded, so. Um. I don't know what to do. I, I got a cutscene of him going into the sewer. Do I need two hearts with Marlin? Oh God. I have two hearts with him. Was that just like his heart cutscene maybe that I that I saw? Dang it, Sophia's gone. Okay, she's down here. Happy birthday, Olive! Sophia, wait! I have something for you. Yay! Clicks. Okay. I guess I just have to figure out how to do it in Expanded, because I know how to do it in normal Stardew Valley, but not in Expanded. Oh, cutscene. Oh, Shella, you're wondering what that good smell is? Why, that's nice of you to say I'm actually baking my famous cookies. Here, why don't you try one? Oh yeah, the traveling merchants today, you're right. I have so much going on. What do you think? It's delicious. Thank you! I think I've come to know you well enough to give you my recipe. Just make sure to keep it a secret. Yes, I'm unstoppable now. Here you go, George. Please, love me. I still have five hearts with him. Might need friendship with Marlin and Expanded. I remember I had trouble with it too. I guess I should look into what Marlin likes. Yeah, I can kill ghosts for you. Would I be able to do that in Skull Caverns, or do I have to go to the regular caverns? Fried mushroom recipe? I don't know if I do. Where would it be? Fried Oh, I do. Oh, but I need oil. Almond, mushroom, and amoral. I guess I could buy some oil from Pierre's. I am Ghostbusters. It is me. I know, right? I would love uh, a cookie recipe from Granny IRL. Here we go. Hello, Mr. Raccoon. I'm just gonna go kill ghosts. What level do ghosts spawn in? Ooh, caviar. If I was a good person, I could buy that for Pierre. But I don't think I will. I will get this mahogany dresser though, that's really pretty. That's all, goodbye. 51 to 70. Aww. That's sadly. I'm sorry. Fifty-one to seventy-nine. Okay. 
Got it. You've got it. Right, tomorrow I'm going to go upgrade my hoe. Now I'm going to go kill ghosts. Eh. I can do it. <laughs> All right, let's go to the mines. 51. So let's go to 50. Any ghosts? Any ghost to ghost? I'm gonna get this iron while I'm here, might as well. Um, what did I just write on my to-do list? Uh, upgrade hoe. I want to get my golden hoe. Oh yeah, chat was talking about the romanceable, like, hot wizard mod earlier. Whoops. I did not mean to go to that level. Maybe... Maybe I'll try 60. I just want it to be smaller so I can, like, see the whole level. There we go. Let me reset it. I just need two ghosts. That's all. This is a great way to farm iron, at least. There's also a mod that gives her seasonal outfits. Dang. When your mod needs mods. That's when I get overwhelmed. If, if I download a mod that, that has mods for it, I'm like, oh boy. Too many layers. Too many layers to the lasagna. A ghost! Hello! Die. All right, one done. Hi, Easy. Welcome in. I've got over 100 mods, and most of them are visual. 100 mods? Dang, that's intense. Ooh, I think I just got to mining level 10. Oh, that makes your kids into NPCs. That's interesting. There we go. Second ghost. Die. Mine. Die. 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 There we go. Um, now I just need to go talk to the wizard. Is it? There we go. You have a little over 90. Dang, some of y'all are intense modders. It's impressive. It's very impressive. Okay. Ooh, I wonder if the ghost fish makes like a cool outfit. Every time I get an item, I'm like, ooh, what would that look like as a shirt? <laughs> That's my first thought. I think there's something wrong with me. The wonderful wizard of Oz. Goodbye, ghost fish. I don't think I can talk to the wizard this late. Which is... rather unfortunate. So I'll have to stop by him tomorrow. I guess I'll bring him a void essence while I'm at it. I have an eye for fashion. It's true. I'm the uh, Edna mode of Stardew Valley. Edna mode. You have 85 mods? Oh my god. Okay, level 10 mining. Chances to find geodes are doubled or gems are worth 30% more. Ooh, okay. That's kind of a difficult one. Here's my thing. I think the geode one might be worth it because... 
of what you can buy with the omni geodes in the desert right like isn't that alone like worth it i don't know Yeah, it will also help me complete the museum faster. Okay, I'm gonna do that. Twice as luck or twice as likely to find geodes. There we go. Sold to the highest bidder. Oh, there's a poll in chat. Do you mod star do? I guess I'll participate. I suppose you could say I'm a bit of a modder. Okay, fortune teller. Good humor today. It's gonna snow. La, 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 la. You like to cheat gifts for the villagers? Oh my goodness, you little cheating cheater. That's okay, live your best life. Okay, I'm going to get five of these. Oh, I just realized, um, I need 10,000 gold. What am I going to sell? My soul? Maybe. Um, I could sell like half of my goat cheese, I suppose. That's fine. I think you already sold that. That's true. So true, bestie. Oh, stay safe, Simmer. Isaac, what's up? Ooh, powder melons. Lots of them. I got so many powder melon seeds. That's fair, rubber band. That's fair. Wow, thanks for the gold. Not. Do I need to fish one out of there now that they're full? So that they'll make another one? Is that how fishing works? Or are they gonna keep expanding? Yeah, I gotta make more room. Oh yeah, getting Iridium without going to Skull Caverns can be kind of hard. All right, let me go fish up. The cap at 10? Oh. Well then should I leave it in there? Little cavern scares you. I like it. It's like a rush of adrenaline. All you need is a good solid cheese. And a lot of luck. Sorry that you're naked. There we go. Okay, um... There we go. Okay, everyone's been pet. <laughs> it's true though. I am sorry that they're naked. I, I took their their clothes from them yesterday. I feel a little bad, you know. Hi everyone. Hi Barney. My cute little dinosaur. Okay, I should be able to complete Gus's egg quest today. One, two, three, four, five, six. I think after I get to floor 100 of the Skull Caverns, I might install the mod for it. The elevator mod. I just want to get to floor 100, like on my own and then maybe I'll I'll do it I'll do it we'll see so 
Ooh, cornucopia mod? Nice. Catching up on the earlier VODs for Stardew Valley save and the difference in your opinions on mining is so funny. Wait, what did I say? <laughs> what did I say? Aw, that's cute. Yeah, I've been posting the VODs to YouTube, so feel free to enjoy. Okay, Void Essence. I'm gonna go visit the wizard, so I'll bring him this as well. Oh, and I should grab all the eggs that I need. For Gus. So he can make a giant omelet. Oh, yeah, so I think I remember this was the save where every, like, level for me was, like, a monster level. And I was like, what is happening? This is the worst thing that's ever happened to me in my life. Oh! <gasps> Oh my god, he found a wife? Hungry, need fruit. Dried strawberries and cherry jelly. Oh my god, say less. <gasps> Whoa, and she sells... She's a businesswoman. She's selling the seeds. For maple seeds, sap, moss, and pine cones. I love that for her. Wow. That is so cute. You had different things? Really? Wow. I will help them make a baby. With the strawberry jelly. Yeah, her man is literally begging for food and she's like supporting the family with a business. Here's your payment as promised. Thank you, Rasmodius. Here's your payment as promised. Goodbye. La la la. Ooh. Nichols. I love wiggles. Ooh, they're carrot seeds now. That's so interesting. Because spring is on the way. We're so close to spring, you guys. I'm so happy for them. They're starting a life together. So cute. Um, Expanded had an update today, so maybe you need to update it. I know, we're so close to year two already. Kind of wild. Hello, everyone. It's me. Digging in your trash. Here we go. Just here to deliver the eggs you ordered. You're welcome, Gus, my boy. I think I can get a ticket now. How much longer am I going to stream? Um, I don't know. I would like to get us in a place where I'm ready for spring, but we'll see what happens. Okay, um, Willie wants bug guts, a hundred pieces, and Rasmodius wants ectoplasm. Um, Maybe I'll do Willy's quest. I've been helping Rasmodius a lot recently. Oh, the little ticket box comes with a, the new update. Bombs! Oh my god, this is the best day of my life. Huge bombs. And I don't know what that hat is, but I'm gonna get it. Yeah, bugs will be easy. All right, on my way to Clunt to have him upgrade my hoe into a golden hoe. Hello! I'm back again. Oh, I'm glad I got paid. I was going to sell my goat cheese, but I guess I don't need to now. Bye! Now I'm poor. I only have 491 simoleons. Yeesh! I don't even think I can get to the desert. Isn't it like 500? Oof. Oh, of course I see wiggly worms as soon as I freaking put my hoe in. Right. 
Great. Thanks a lot. Oh, I just started calling him that. Yeah, every time I use the ticket machine, I'm like, ooh, new shiny. Uh. Yes, simoleons. Ooh, I can bring you a ruby, George, especially if it will give me friendship with you. Okay, George and Sophia both could use gifts. And I need dried strawberries and cherry jelly. So let me go home. Freaking wiggle worms, they're taunting me. Ah! Okay. Here we go. Oh, hopefully this weekend will be when I upload. That's the aim. As long as my basement doesn't flood again. Ha ha. <laughs> Sad. Life happens. I did record not so berry, so that's going up tomorrow. Why did I have so many gold bars? Where were those from? I thought that I used them for my upgrade. Did I not? Only used one? I'm confused. Okay, I have strawberries, so I can do strawberry and then cherry. I don't think I have a cherry. Wait, this is a disaster. How am I going to get a cherry? <gasps> oh, no. I don't. I don't have a cherry. I guess I'll go buy a cherry tree when I have money. No. Oh, I just got them off the furnace. Oh, <laughs> I'm so dumb. <laughs> That's so funny. Okay. Kill bugs. Okay, okay, okay. Everything's fine. I have a mushroom cave, so I literally think I would have to buy a cherry sapling. Um, or get lucky with the traveling merchant. This is unfortunate. I kind of have to pee. I'm going to go I'm going to go pee at the end of the day. All right, pepper for George. Oh, and he wanted a ruby. Rose for Sophia. Ruby for George. Okay. Let's go. I don't need to go play Stardew, I think. I think you should. Is anybody else here playing Stardew Valley at this time? Just a question. Yeah, the Traveling Merchant has been pretty nice to me. I will say that. I also need to double check because I'm not fully certain that I don't need any more winter fish. So I need to make sure I'm, I'm not going to run out of time for that. There you go. And here's a pepper as well. Please give me your recipe. And then I'll leave you alone forever. I promise. I'll never talk to you again. One, two, three, four, five, six. I have six hearts with him. Oh my gosh, so many of us are playing. That's so fun. What season are y'all in? Hmm. Yeah, I, I did the strawberries. I... I have the strawberries drying. He has the spicy eel recipe. Okay, these are my bundles. I need a catfish in a shad, a walleye, a red snapper in a tilapia. So I just need to make sure none of those are winter fish. I could take the time right now and Google them one by one, which I might do. Because I don't want to run out of time. Let me look them up. Dang. A lot of us are in year one. I'm still in year one for now. Okay. Catfish. It could be found in spring and fall. Okay, so I will get that next season. Or winter with a rain totem. Shad. Spring, 
or summer during the rain. Walleye. My grandpa used to catch walleye all the time. Walleye. Mountain lake during winter with a rain totem or fall. That is horrific. What can I do to get a rain totem? I would need truffle oil, I think, for the rain totem, right? I'm just going to do it one by one. It's easier for me to understand this way. I do not want to have to wait until fall for this thing. Oh, I'm so mad at myself that I do not have that one. How the heck am I going to get truffle oil? I have pigs, but they will not go outside right now because it's winter. We're in a bit of a conundrum. Summer, fall, winter with rain totem. Okay, so that one's not till summer. You can find walleye in treasure boxes in Skull Caverns. Really? Tilapia. Summer or fall. Ginger Island. Well, that is going to be really impossible. Because I'm not anywhere close to unlocking Ginger Island yet. I wonder if my cat can bring me a walleye. Oh, a rain totem. Okay. Truffle oil from the traveling merchant. Yeah, I guess I'll have to... My best bet right now is to get truffle oil from a traveling merchant and hopefully catch a red snapper and a walleye. Um, and I guess a catfish or a shad too. It's really just the rainfish that I'm, like, missing. Okay, Sophia is at her farm. Oh, boy. Lobia can be found in the ocean. You don't need the island. Oh, it said ocean ginger island, so maybe I read it as, like, the ocean at ginger island, but you're saying it's both locations. Okay. That's easier then. I didn't pay attention to the season, though. There's a high chance I won't be able to finish the community center until fall. Um, which is not the biggest deal. It is what it is, but... You know. Summer year one is when you got your tilapia. Hi, Sophia. Bye, Sophia. She's probably like, who is that crazy farmer girl just running around? Okay, I have to pee. But first I should go to the mines. I have to go kill bugs. Bugs start on level... I don't know. I feel like level 20 or something is a good level to go to. She's always giving me flowers, right? That's just me. Oh, you're starting a new save file? Nice. Yeah, they're kind of in the first few levels. Maybe I should try 15. I don't know if there's usually bugs on level one. Oh, here we go. I just need bug meat, so I think killing these grubs will give me bug meat. Yeah, okay. Collect a bunch of bug meats. Hi, Zui, how are you? Oh, this is a jackpot. Look at all these bugs. Oh, shell, yeah. This is floor 16. Great floor. 10 out of 10 would visit again. Yeah, we'll stay early. A bug steak would be a good compliment to a mayonnaise drink. Ooh. 
Heebie jeebies. Bug meat. Oh, I'm lucky. I got an infested level. They'll all be flying at me. <gasps> Yay! That's awesome, Snorticles. Happy to inspire. Goblin OC Stardew Run, the only things you can eat are bug steak and mayonnaise. That'd be really funny. Like a really fun challenge. Goblin core. It would suck though, because you want to be able to get luck or anything. Dang it, that's dwarf scroll number one. I need a dwarf scroll number two. I have number one and number three. There we go. Oh, I don't want to be on this level, actually. I hate this level. Thank you. So many bugs! Maybe we can add more goblin -esque things to the menu. I feel like goblins would eat candy, too. Ooh, another infestation. Let's go. I have not exempt form. That sounds gross. <laughs> Goblins would eat cheese. I agree with that. I mean, my favorite thing is cheese after all, so. Any, uh, any bugs in the chat? Here we go. Okay, that was not worth me sitting around. Uh, each season is 28 days long. Alright, I'm gonna go back to floor 15. I must have scared them all away. They saw I was just a big strong goblin and they're like, oh god. Too much for me. She's so scary. They heard us talking about bug steak. Yeah, apparently. Alright, level 16 was lucky last time. This time, no bugs. I'm leaving. Oh my god, I... As weird as that sounds, I also do not like being on camera. <laughs> as I'm sitting here on camera, but like... If being a no-cam streamer was a thing that worked for me, I would do it. But I do like having like my face for reactions and stuff, it's just... Being perceived is not my fave. I know VTubing is a thing as well, but I don't know. <laughs> yeah, that's where VTubers come into play. True! I think I'd be sad though. Because sometimes I do like being on camera. Just replace the cam with her smile. I could do that. That oh, I could do. Okay, I got 35 bug meat in one day. Unfortunately, they want fresh meat, so it's going to take me a bit of time. But we can do this. I can do it. VTubing is too technically complicated for me. I feel like it's just kind of intimidating, but I believe that there are some very, like, informative, like, tutorials and resources if you, like really wanted to get into it but I am very intimidated by the setup process that is for sure okay 
Um, this one goes here. Have me mayo. Perfect. All right, I can finally go pee. Shella is free. It'd be hard to be perceived like that. It is. Oh my god, I'm so poor. I'm not making any money. No money. It's okay. We'll make money soon. All right, I'm going to BRB chat. I just have to go to the bathroom. Um, in the meantime, it's a good time for you to get up, fill that water bottle that you've been neglecting, um, stretch. And if you are enjoying the stream, don't forget to hit the follow button and uh, consider checking out my YouTube. That's all. I'll be right back. <laughs> okay, I'm back. Thanks for waiting. I realized that Rayla's been in the room, but I didn't notice. She just left her cat treat because I came in. What is happening? Why is there a do you love yellow pole? Wow. I can't believe you guys are trying to do this right now. In this economy? Oh my god, wait. Rayla's being so cute, you guys. Hold on. There she is. That's not Olivia. That's Rayla. Rayla! Rayla! Hey! Hi, Cozy! Oh, she's just rolling all over the place. Rayla! Hi, baby! Are you cleaning yourself? Yeah? Yeah, big stretch! You're so long! She is so long. Oh my god. She's showing off right now. Hi, Rayla. Gonna bite on your toes? Okay, do what you gotta do. Is that yummy? She's like, all right, no pictures. Thank you. <laughs> She's so funny. All right, let me go ahead. That was cute. She cleaned it real good. All right. Are we ready to continue? We're almost ready for spring. There are a couple things that I wanted to do before spring, but I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do them. Um, and they included getting my deluxe coop, which I have the resources for, I just need 20,000 simoleons. So I really could just like sell a bunch of stuff and get it, which I might. Okay, what are the spirits like today? Annoyed, same. Um, you've proven your trustworthiness. I would like to propose I teach you some basic magic. Visit me in your ch in my chambers at your earliest convenience. <gasps> That's exciting. Oh, and Gus gave us a fridge. Whoa. Okay. Thanks, Gus. An entire refrigerator. <laughs> I'll take that. Sure. Okay, I have my dried strawberry. I'm so sad. I, I'm not going to be able to get dried cherries until I either, one, grow an entire cherry tree. I don't know. Can you get cherries from the traveling merchant? I feel like I haven't ever seen them in there before. I have the kitty head right now. I, I also like using the slime head, too. I don't have the fruit cave now. That's the problem. I have the mushrooms. Now that there's mushroom stumps, I feel like next time I'm I'm gonna just like get the fruit cave. I don't know. I'm gonna should I go to the wizard today? Are y'all curious about that? Because I'm kinda curious about like the wizard said he wants to teach me some magic. Should I go see what that means? Robin doesn't work today anyways. But like I really I could sell like some of my stuff. Like, this is 20,000 right here. I don't know. We'll have to see. I don't know if it's new for 1.6 or if it's um an expanded storyline. I'm not sure. My pomegranate tree is growing as well. That's good to see. 
yeah, I'm curious to see if I can, like, learn magic and stuff, because that's kind of exciting. It is starter expanded? Okay. The freaking wiggle worms, they know I don't have my hoe. They know it. They're taunting me. How dare they? All right, let me just cut your hair off. Thanks. You don't have it without it? Gotcha. I really wish the pigs would go outside and give me truffles. That would save my whole life. Yes, I'm lacking my hoe. It's at Clint's right now, getting upgraded. Oh, man. Um, I don't know which one is considered better. I haven't really been using my mushroom cave, though, so. I mean, like, even if I did have a fruit cave, like, the, the chances of me getting cherries, you know, it's random, so it's not, like, a guaranteed thing. But I don't think that there's, like, a better or worse option. I feel like it becomes a little bit obsolete to have the fruit cave, though, like later on especially because you can just get the fruit trees so it becomes this thing that you don't even need anymore and then the mushroom cave does come with a dehydrator that is true that's a big one okay i need to kill bugs in the mines but i guess i'll go say hi to the wizard first I don't fully know what to do. Yeah, fruit can help you complete the community center early, but I didn't have a fruit bundle this time, so I got I got lucky. Good to see you, Mel. How are you? How you doing? I'm off to see the wizard. I hope he teaches me some cool magic. I'm ready to slay. Hello. Ooh. Here we go. Why is he shaking a plant? Just a moment. Huh? I'm gathering herbs for your elixir. Have no fear, Shella. You have my assurance that it won't be as harsh as the first one you drank. Come, join me at the cauldron. Okay, I don't trust this guy. <laughs> the first one he had me drink, that was a whole thing. One final touch. The elixir is complete. With this, you can begin accumulating mana from the world around you, allowing you to cast some minor magic. Here, drink up. What? Am I a magical goblin? Whoa. The elixir tasted like cotton candy. Good. Now when you're ready, join me downstairs in my study. Oh, this is so exciting, you guys. I think that this is Stardew Valley Expanded. First, a demonstration. Oh my god, he has pink hair now! You look beautiful! Now, you try. Oh, I actually have a mod that lets me do that, but sure. Ah! On your first attempt, no less marvelous! Who was that? Most impressive, Shella. Perhaps in the future, I'll teach you some more spells. If your aptitude is as high as it seems, we may even explore some higher theory about the governing laws that bind our world. Yippee! Glad to see the prospect excites you. That's kind of scary. You can now use the Shrine of Illusions. Okay, so that's something that you can get in the regular game without expanded just by becoming his friend, so... 
Um, that's interesting. Why is his name Magnus? Is it... Is it Magnus Rasmodius? Is that why? Oh, and he's single. You can date him. The ability to change your appearance is a great responsibility. Don't go overboard. Well, I can do that like this, so it's not that deep. No offense, Rasmodius. <laughs> I can't wait to see what other things he can teach me, though. That's exciting. Man, now I'm wondering, should I romance the wizard? Hmm. Hmm. Decisions. I think Sophia's kind of sweet, though. I think it's an expanded thing. I call him Razzle Dazzle. <laughs> oh my goodness. Well, that's exciting. All right, I'm going to go to the mines today. To yearn. I think I'm also going to sell some things so I can make some money. I just have a lot. I'm going to sell a lot of gems. Because I would like to um, upgrade my coop. And I need 20,000 for that. Okay. To the mines. Ooh, what should you call your farm? That's a fun question. Chad, do you have any uh, farm name suggestions? A big decision. All right, we're trying to get a hundred juicy bug meats. That's why we're here today. My farm's name is a uh, Goblin Grove. It is the hardest part of the game, right? Yeah, I heard that there's a mod for a female wizard. Maybe in another playthrough. Oh, you're not gonna give me any bug meat? La, la, la. Ooh, grubbies. Give me your meat. Fairytale Farm? That reminds me of my favorite anime. <laughs> Die! Um, I guess I'm gonna reset. I love Fairytale, it's my favorite anime. It's like my comfort anime. I watched it um, as I was going through high school and college. It was still airing at the time. It's your favorite too? No way! <laughs> Ooh, look at those geodes! Let's go! And a bunch of them. Is as your favorite? My favorite character is Mavis. I like her. And Mira Jane. Yeah, I read the manga chapters as well as they were coming out. Kinda crazy. Give me your juicy meat. I need these bugs. That always happens to me too, staunchly. I have my hoe upgrading and I keep seeing wiggle worms. It's like, are you taunting me? It's like they know. Okay, I'm at 53 bug meats. Oh, nice. Alright. Another one of my favorite animes is 
season one of The Devil is a Part-Timer. I tried watching season two and I couldn't really get into it, but the first season was great. All right, let me go get these up here. Yeah, it has a second season. You're doing the same task. How many do you have? I have 56. 56 bug meats. 57. go show me what you got me bugs oh there's some die you only need 20 oh my god i wish i only needed 20 61 that's okay at least this is happening in winter when i don't really have a reason to be outside so it's like whatever i spend all day Getting bug meat. Hi, more. Hope you're doing well today. All right, I'm gonna go back down to floor five, I think. Any bugs? No, no bugs. No bugs. You're also in winter year one. Nice. Hi, Rayla. Hi. Well, I wonder where Tony is. If she's coming in here, he must be gaming. And she wants attention. Oh, bugs are after level 10? Okay. Well, that's good to know. I'm on level 11, so... Okay. I, ideally, I want to be prepped for spring next time we play, but we'll see what happens. I am getting kind of tired. Oh, the jackpot! The mother load, even! Nice. That was a good one. Those were some juicers. Should I just redo this floor over and over again? Maybe I should. It's nice and, like, small. Yeah, maybe I'll do that. I'll redo, like, floor 20. Floor 20. No bugs. I have 67 meat. No bugs. Okay, maybe this is not a great plan. <laughs> Here we go. One bug. Lots of boxes. We'll see what happens. Hey, nerdy, how are you? Welcome. Welcome. I am a little bit nervous. I don't know if I should upgrade my coop because we're getting into the territory where I should probably be saving up for spring crops. So I'm starting to think like maybe, maybe coop upgrade's gonna have to wait. This is cutting it close right now. It's just, I feel like in winter, my cash flow comes to an absolute halt. I also have not been selling my milk and cheese, which is part of the problem. I should probably do that. 69 bug meat. Oh yeah, I don't know how long it's going to take for it to come out on console. I'm really genuinely hoping it's only like a month delayed because there are so many people waiting for console to come out. But we'll see what happens. I think it's just all based on like the approval for it to be on consoles. It has to be like approved update and stuff like that. I don't know. It's probably like a really tedious process to go through. True. I'm trying to think of what I should grow this year because I don't necessarily need 
different crops for the community bundle. So, like, maximize my profits. I'm trying to think of what I should grow in the spring. I feel like strawberries definitely is a thing I want to grow. I don't know if I have strawberry seeds, though. Does... Does Pierre sell them in year two, strawberry seeds, or are they still only a, a festival item? Exactly 10 days when I have to travel, that'd be nice. Melons maybe? Yeah, I could do melons. <sighs> yeah, I'm trying to remember if I have strawberry seeds. I don't think I do. And I just turned a bunch of my strawberries into um, dried strawberries, so, for the, the raccoons. Maybe I can see if I can make enough seeds out of the rest of them. They have like a couple left. Then I can look at everything else that I need to make. I could grow some flowers for like honey and stuff like that though. Uh oh. Silly kids take over. Alright, here we go. Only one bug. I'm at 78. I don't think I'm gonna finish it today. Parabog, thank you so much for the first time sub. Chat, you know what that means. Enjoy your emotes and your ad free viewing. But most importantly, enjoy your new smile. Let's go. Perfect. <laughs> thank you so much. Am I going to stream for much longer? Um. Ideally, yes. I am getting tired, but we'll see what happens. All right, I'm at 84, maybe 85? Yes, okay, 85 bug meats. So I just need a couple more. Very good, chat, very good. All right, let's go home. Almost done. That was so boring all day, just going in the same level of the mines. Hey, Q, how are you doing? I think my hoe's gonna be ready tomorrow. I guess I'll just sell the stuff I got today. Might as well. Chaos. Mm -hmm. Oh. I got an ancient seed. Isn't that delightful? Love that for me. Oh, it's been a busy day for you? Busy at work? That sucks. At least you get to relax and hang out now. Hang out, vibe, all those fun things. Okay, here we go. Okay, and then... Actually, I should just put the ancient seed in my seed maker. Oh, never mind. I understand. I know how to craft it. There we go. Perfect. So now I have four ancient seeds. That's not bad. That is not bad. There we go. Cloth. There we go. Okay. Yeah. We are big successful at the farm. Maybe I'll make some money tonight. <laughs> I think I sold like a bunch of... Oh! A baby goat! Oh my god. Okay, we were naming the baby goats after cheese. So we have Colby. And we have... Oh, I think we were going to do Gouda next. Gouda the goat. Right? I haven't found an ancient seed yet and I'm in fall. Oh no! We have Colby and Feta. And now we're going to have Gouda. 
Gouda the goat. I think that's cute. Yeah, I sold like so many gems. <laughs> There we go. Made 15 grand. That's better. It's good to have some money. The bookseller is in town today and so is my golden hoe. Pick up hoe. Bookseller. All right. Sophia's birthday is coming up as well, so I need to be ready to give her the, the star drop tea. And tomorrow is the Winter Star Festival. Ooh, exciting times. Hey, I found this in a drawer somewhere. Thought you could use it. Energy tonic? Thanks, Pam. Yeah, okay. I have a gift for my secret friend, Pierre. It's gonna be a weed. I'm surprised no one said that's Gouda. <laughs> Chat, you fumbled the bag. What crops should you get with your 500 gold? Ooh, um, I don't know. Maybe some parsnips, some potatoes, some green beans. We'd feel more at home with two mega bombs. Said no one ever. What? Okay. Let me just throw these bombs in here for you. There you go. Everyone look, fresh mega bombs. <laughs> yeah, that sounds like a really bad idea. Oh my gosh, hi honey. Thank you for the four month resub. Welcome back. I got another ancient fruits. Oops. Let's go. Let me just drop some bombs into my fish pond. Nothing to see here. One of these days, I'll get George's spicy eel recipe and I'll be unstoppable. I love me some mega bombs for Brecky. Have you ever eaten a mega bomb chat? Real talk. Welcome back. Okay, they're bald. Bald. Is it like a jawbreaker? Maybe. Every day. Oh, look! The baby goat! Oh, that's so cute! It's Gouda cheese and it's like white, like Gouda cheeses. That's so cute. I could cry. Gourmet Pop Rocks. Oh my god. Y'all, are you okay? Are you okay, chat? Good morning, chickens and Barney. He's so freaking cute. I love him so much. Ooh. I think I'm going to uncheck the uh, purple dinosaur thing. I just wanted to have one. But now that I have one, I think I could like have all of them. There we go. I know, isn't he so cute? I have a little purple dinosaur. I was trying to get a dinosaur for so long and I finally got one last episode we found a dinosaur floor got very lucky All right there we go can i make more pots clay stone and refined quartz i think i actually do have my clay stock built up again i could refine a couple more quartz perhaps Clay, stone, refined quartz. How much do I need? Oh yeah, should I turn that into seeds? I think I do, right? Just gonna put this in my seed maker. 
One of your chickens laid a void egg? Ooh, lucky, lucky. Mega bomb sounds like a good alcoholic drink. Wait, there's a poll for chat. Are you okay? Oh my god. No or don't ask. Oh no, chat is not okay. Alright, I just need two more of these to finish my like coffee bean setup. Go ahead and plant some more in there. And then I have a little bit of a errand to run today. I need to go pick up me pick up me ho. And me Oh yeah, the bookseller. Oh my god. Um at the bookseller, I should definitely like I should bring all my books. See if I can trade them in, right? You mean me? Oh hi Tony, there you are. Yeah, uh, you're at Clint's. I gotta come and pick you up. There's a lot of things I don't have yet. Okay, here we go. Ooh, that sounds pretty. What time am I wanting to consume food? Um... How about in an hour? Is that good? Does that work for you? No, it doesn't? Okay. Well, then I will simply not consume food. Hope this helps. Why'd you ask? <laughs> oh my god. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and drop this off in here. Blink. Oh yeah, I could take my um freaking what are they called? Yeah, I'll eat my crops. That's true. I have my fresh grown produce right here, actually. Homegrown on shell farm. <laughs> I'll feed you. Okay, coming, coming over. Aw, I'm glad you enjoyed the Among Us. The video is up on YouTube. I got it up so fast. I posted it at lightning speed for everyone. Gold ho! Let's go! Thank you. Um, I would like you to process my geodes, good sir. Um, it should say in the quest if he'll let you keep it or not. I'll say like, I'll even let you keep it when you deliver it. So if it doesn't say that, then he, he probably is going to take it. Yeah, sorry. Clunch jump scare. Come on, give me something good. Something that I need for my community center or my museum. I know, right? You need a referral to my geode guy? Well, I don't know if I'd recommend Clint, to be honest with you. Oh, what's that? Book of Mysteries? What do you mean? I've learned a new power? You have a slightly greater chance to find mystery boxes. Oh. Well, ain't that swell. Ain't that just swell. Lunch. Oh, I don't have anything to donate. Dang it. Okay, let's go to the bookseller and see if I can trade in any of my books. I can get all the wiggle worms that have been taunting me. Dang it. <laughs> Sorry, everyone. This is not where I meant to go. Oh my god. Not a cutscene. Hi, Rayla. Come on, kiddo. I don't got all day. Yes, ma'am. I understand. I'll ring this up for you now. Oh, is Pam a Karen? She would be. Uh, 
How does this... Hmm. Cam's a Karen. Hey, Claire, can you help me with this transaction? Um, sure. Wasting my time. Oh, you need to press the other items button. Ah, oh, that was it. Would you like your receipt, ma'am? No. How does... I've had that experience. <laughs> that lady is kind of scary. She's a regular customer, so you will see her again. Mm, well, anyway. Thanks for helping. You're welcome. He's one of your favorites from Expanded. Yeah, I feel bad for him. Okay, bookseller, I'm here today with all my books. I could get, ooh, three river jelly, check. 20 hardwood, stuffing. Pepper poppers. I mean, sure. I guess I'll just get everything. The only one I can't get is the monster manual. I need two of those, apparently. Wait, can I buy the way of the wind? I can. I can run a little faster if with this. I've been wanting this. Should I do it? I too have dealt with the Karen. Yeah, it's rough. I think I'm going to do it. Way of the wind. Hold on, let me get a screenshot. For thumbnails. She's a content creator. Okay. Here we go. You learned a new power. Whee! I can run faster! Or is that just the coffee? I think that's just the coffee speaking. At this time. Vegetable medley. Oh my. Who's throwing that out? Could be both. Hey, can you not be here? I'm trying to dig in the trash. Oh. All right. Now I just need to go kill bugs in the mine. Just need 15 more today. If I'm content, does that make my parents content creators? You know? Yeah. They are. They're the OG content creators, if you think about it. They created me. That's pretty impressive. Dun dun dun! <laughs> the layers. Okay, um. Ba -ba -da -ba -da. La -da 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 -da. Okay, I need to organize before I can do anything else. I must be at peace. So much food. Oh yeah, and then I want to see if I can get wool out of this. Thanks. Did I get the garbage hat yet? I sure did. Not to brag. But I definitely have the garbage hat. Yeah, my cat's wearing it as we speak. Alright, to the mines! I yearn. I don't know if I feel faster at all. Like, how much faster does the Step of the Wind book make you run? Because I don't feel like I'm going any faster, really. That was 15,000 simoleons. 
Hey, Hexwitch, how are you? Welcome. Oh, I need to kill you. Really? No meat from either of those? I got skimossed. Okay. 87! It didn't help you that much? Well, shoot. I feel like I just spent a waste of money. <gasps> oh my god! Wait! Oh my god. I should go to the bookseller. I just got a second monster compendium. I could go get a slime egg press. I mean, it's not like that pressing, lol. Pun intended. But like, you know, maybe I guess I'll wait. I can't really do anything about that yet. But I would like to get a slime thing for my farm eventually. Well, that's exciting. At least I know I can do that now. You move 0.25% faster. That's it? I want to go even faster. Can I like stack it? Can I get more books? Keep going fast? Like if I buy another one? Is that something I could do with my money when I'm rich? Oh, there's a part two. Hmm, I must not be at that part yet. Well. No, Tyrus, that's rough. Yeah, I guess if I drink coffee, I probably feel like this is slow because this is not as fast as me drinking coffee, so. There we go. Oh my god, so many bugs. Give me your meat. Give me your meat. Seriously? No meat? Come on! A97? There we go. 98? Only two more. I know, coffee makes you realize how fast you go. I always get really excited when I get a coffee seed. Especially before summer. That's like the best. Come on! Give me meat! Jackpot! Alright. Place the bug meat in the barrel next to Willie's house. Alright, Willie. I'm on my way over. And it's the Feast of the Winter Star tomorrow, so I'm excited for that. All right, there we go. So close to the bug goal. We did it. It's a juicy wad of bug flesh. I don't like that it's juicy. That bothers me a little bit. It's a little concerning. Ah. Glass shards. Snow yam. I haven't been down here in a minute. Let me pick up all the coral. Ooh, Nautilus shell. Whoa, mystery box. More squirmy wormies. Perfect. I have had this quest like winter mystery, find the shadowy figure. I haven't found him yet. Am I looking in the wrong places for him? Cause I thought he was supposed to be like by the ocean. And I just haven't seen him. If I get a horse, I'll go really fast. It's true. I do want to get a horse. Yay! Go to the bush by the playground. Okay. I'll go over there tonight. Can I still go to Mayor Lewis's house? Excuse me. Knock, knock. Coming in. Good evening. Is it Mayor Lewis? Is it? I want to see what this is. Sports cap. Ooh, a decoration tree. Oh wait, that's kind of cute. It looks like my ponytail's like going through it. That's not bad. Where are you going this late at night? Oh, okay, it's your bed. 
or footsteps for you to follow. All right, let me see if I can find them. Good night, Harvey. Oh, these footsteps, I see. I noticed these, I just never followed them. Oh, there it is. Hi. Beep, you caught me, I'm sorry, take it, take it. It looks so valuable, I couldn't help myself. You received the magnifying glass. You now have the ability to find secret notes. These notes reveal rare and useful information and can be reviewed in your collections tab. I don't want you to run away though, I'm sorry. Poor guy. Well, I'll keep my eyes out for some secret notes then. Poor little guy. He probably ran back to the sewer. I know, I know, it's so cute, my little ears. Yeah, maybe it is Krobus. I wouldn't be surprised. Okay. Glass shards or clothes? You tell me. It is Krobus? What a little cutie. I can't wait to officially meet him. Why is a duck feather in there? What the heck? Um. Mm, okay. Seeds. Okay. Um, oh, I should have put the muscle in there. Nope. Yes. Yes. Snow yam. Yes. Duck feather. Monster manual. Oh my gosh, thank you, boss. I appreciate it. It's not too shabby for a year one farm, you know? It will look so much better, like... <laughs> when everything's actually in season, though. I got a cloth, so I'm gonna go see if I can turn these glass shards into fashion. Here we go! Officer- Alright. I'm not about to become a cop. I have the hat, too. I think. I have two mystery hats, so oh. could sell one of them. Do I have a cop hat? No, I don't. I have the sailor's cap. Um, I got this sewing machine from doing a quest for Emily. <laughs> ah! You scared me! That was so loud! Oh my god, I think I'm gonna get a void egg. That's really exciting. <laughs> void chicken! On Winterfest! <laughs> Woohoo! I'm not sure, I've never done a recolor mod. Is that what that was? Yeah! That was Sillykins, the witch! I'm gonna have a void chicken. Time to make some void mayonnaise. Oh, thank you, Spooky Hexy Witch. I appreciate it. So kind. You know, us green gals gotta stick together. Okay, um, I need to get my dandelion for Pierre. Yeah, that happened to you too. Yeah, that, so that's what the witch does. The witch gives you a void egg. It's, I'm not sure how common the event is. Um, I've had it happen to me quite a few times, but I still think it's a rather rare event. Oh, I love 1.6. I'm having so much fun. 
I also play it on the Switch. I have it on my Switch and my PC, and I could not wait for the update, so... I decided to play <laughs> on my PC, and I'm playing with mods, but I'm having a lot of fun. Here we go, coffee. Link. Hello. The witch hates her coop. You've had it three times? Oh my gosh. She really hates her coop. My goodness. It's a 1% chance of it happening. Okay. Yeah, that's crazy. 1% chance of the witch showing up. Hello, baby Bree. Hello, goat. Hello, piggos. Let me take your clothes. I like that it just cuts off the top part of their hair. I think that's so funny. Okay, time to make some more wool, some fabric today. Let's see the void egg. There it is! All right, definitely putting that in the um, incubator. Good night. You had it in summer year one, nice. You can also buy a void egg, but it's kind of fun to get it from the witch. It's like a little more exciting. But once you unlock the sewers, you can get it from Krobus. But it's kind of expensive, so I will be saving my money thanking you. Okay, today is the Winter Festival. I need to bring a... You guys said he likes daffodils. Is it daffodils or dandelions? I'm gonna look. Oh, both. Okay. Daffodil it is. No offense, Pierre. I'm not going to invest in your gift. Sorry. Woohoo! Okay, population five out of seven. My eels are reproducing. This is very exciting. Things are going well. I'm just gonna grab my mushrooms. Hi, Karita. How you doing? There we go. La -da 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 -da. 39 out of 240. Okay, that means tomorrow I'm going to have to gather some hay, I think. Mushroom cave or fruit cave? Um, I went with the mushroom cave because you get the dehydrator immediately. All right. I'm going to the festival. Ooh, worms. I'm going to the festival. Are you guys excited? I'm excited. Both give you the dehydrator? Hmm. Hello! Oh my god, it's so funny to see you here, Pierre. Do, 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 do. Okay, I already bought this. I like house plants. I'll buy that. That's pretty much all I want. Who am I gifting? Um, I have a gift for Pierre. I'm gonna go see if I can find Sophia. I wish I had Sophia. Is she not here? Where is she? Am I crazy? You had Pierre as your person too? I know. 
Not too happy about it. Sophia. Oh! Oh, she's out by Dusty! Who's a good boy? You are. Did you get a present yet? No. Are you my secret Santa? I relate to that. I would also be by the dog. Whenever there's house parties, I always find the, the animal. Okay, let me go talk to Pierre really quick. You're getting him again in year two? Oh my gosh. Here you go, Pierre. Oh, so it's you. Ah, Daffodil. Thanks. <laughs> it did not seem too happy. Who's it going to be? Oh, it's Penny. Hey, Shella, I'm your secret gift giver this year. Here, open it. Yeah, I expected that. Poppy seed muffin? Hmm. Not much, but I hope you like it. Okay, thanks, Betty. Could have been worse. If I had Clint as my secret Santa, I might have ended it all. <laughs> Hi, Marlin. Good afternoon. Want to hear the legend of the winter star? Yeah. In the night sky of winter, there's a bright star only visible from this valley. No one knows why this is, but in times of old, people would come from far and wide to see it. They believe that anyone who laid eyes on the winter star would be blessed with good fortune. Some even claim that this mysterious fruit, known as the star fruit, is connected to the winter star in some way. Nice lore. I know. You got 500 wood for your gift? Oh my god. That's crazy. Good luck, Nat! I hope it goes well. Well, is there anything else I need to do for the festival? I don't think so, right? Clint gave you gold bars. Clint gave you an iridium bar? Oh my god. You got chip. You got, like, absolutely, like... Scamazed there. Debated. Apparently you can get iridium and he gave you gold. Terrible. Debated. Okay. I have four fabrics, which means I could make four more things. I want to try making a honey. Honey? Um. I've done a duck feather. What else should I turn into clothes? I could do a seashell. I don't think I've done that. Honey, a shell, a pearl... Um, anything else? Bomb fossil. Okay, let's go see what happens. Yay, yippee! <laughs> I love this so much. Making clothes is my favorite part of Stardew Valley. Pants! <gasps> Simple dress. Wait, can I re-dye that because it's yellow? Oh, that's quite exciting. Sailor shirt? I have a sailor cap. Wedding veil! And... No, I have not tried bug meat yet. What is this? Excavator shirt. Cool! You guys, I could be a goblin bride! Wow. Okay, yeah, we're gonna have to... Can I re-dye this? It is dyeable. Good. Don't look at my underwear. If only I can find a sailor skirt, right? I would have the whole outfit. Or maybe a purple mushroom. I think I did do a purple mushroom and it gave me um this shirt. I believe so. Okay. There we go. All right. Good night, everyone. No, I have not adopted a second pet yet. I have been investing in the stalks, aka starfruit. Um, <laughs> I had money once upon a time, and then I bought 116 starfruit seeds, and they have not grown yet. So, 
And in winter, it's just the money don't be flowing, you know? I'd be broke right now. It's true. Oh, I should do I should do a dino egg when I have an extra one. Here's the recipe for my famous blueberry tart. Don't tell anyone. I'm giving it to you because we are such good friends. <gasps> Greetings, young adept. I've enclosed in this package an item of arcane significance. Use it wisely. Thanks. Dear Shella, I want to make fish stew, but I need an albacore. I know they're almost out of season. Sorry about the short notice. Can you catch one for me? Alba Shore, I got you, Gus. I think I have one. I foresaw this. Pink. Right there. No, I'm not blaming chat. I'm not. I just, I was not fully ready, I think, or financially ready to invest in a full greenhouse, but I did it anyways, and now I am paying the price of being poor for however long it takes starfruit to grow, which it looks like it might be almost grown. Yeah, I think Pierre secretly loved his gift. He didn't really show it that much. Yeah, no, I'm gonna make so much money out of this. You guys are gonna, like, your jaw is gonna hit the floor. You're gonna be like, oh my god, you're so rich, Rochella. Don't forget me. I'm gonna be like, who? Who are you? Uh, I know, and I bought the Way of the Wind book. Probably should not have done that. I, I got excited, though. The book tricked me. It's true. It's true. It just looked so appealing. 13 days. Yeah, so it'll probably be done in the next day or two, then. I would like to make some truffle machines as well. Hey, do I need? Okay, I need hardwood slime and gold bar. Yeah, I can do that. And I want to get a shed because like right now I have a lot of my artisan stuff outside, but I would rather just leave that for like chests and stuff and put like my big artisan stuff in a shed. So. I don't know, there's a couple reformatting things that I want to do on my farm. I just haven't, like, actually done it yet. Maybe I should. I could do it today. Um... Yeah, let me just... The Traveling Merchant is in town today. Oh my gosh, your guinea pigs have the zoomies? That must be so cute. They're so tiny and adorable. Einslays, hey! Thank you for the 35 months! I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. How are you? Oh, you were using the, the layout planner? I love that for you. I'm almost level 10 in all of my skills. I could probably really grind foraging if I went and cut down some trees and combat's level 9 as well. Nice! Alright, Gus. On my way. To give you an albacore. Where are you? He's in there? What? Is, what? It doesn't open till 12? Oh my god, why did I run over here so fast? Gus, I freaking hate you. I'll go to the traveling merchant first. Ah, sorry, don't look at me. That wasn't me digging in the trash. That was a raccoon. Haven't you seen them? They moved in. <laughs> Howdy. How's it going? All right. I still have to figure out what to do about the cherry. Do you have a cherry? Ooh, bream. I don't think I need a bream. Ah! Why don't you have what I need? Lobster bisque? Am I a joke to you? 
No, I, I don't think I need a bream. Yeah, I already turned into bream. Okay, I'm kind of embracing that. I'm just going to try to get rich quick. And then finish the community center and fall. Because that's what it's going to happen. Uh, I am running faster. I have coffee. So whenever I drink coffee, I get the zoomies. And I run really fast. I know, isn't it cute? All right. Gus just asked you for a lobster. Oh my god. I'm just gonna be right here, digging in the trash. Guess I'll go to this trash can. I really do like all of the lights and stuff, though, that people put on their houses in winter. I'm gonna miss that. Open up, Gus. Let me in. Oh my god, not this. <laughs> well, folks, once again, we're gathered for a very special occasion. A rare visit from a very dear friend. My world-famous giant omelette. Zesty bell pepper, juicy tomato, rich mushroom, and tangy cheese. All enrobed in a blanket of rich, fluffy egg. Dig in, folks. Where's my invite? I'm the one that supplied the eggs. Willy, what do you think? Hi, Rayla. The mushrooms are a tad chewier than last year. Is that a good thing? It's so crunchy. Hi, lad. It's great, Gus, and it tastes even better because it's on the house. These eggs are so rich and yellow. Marnie, are these from your place? Nope, you can thank Shella over at Goblin Grove Farm. Mmm, Goblin Grove eggs. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, congrats, Q. That's awesome. Gus, where are you? Get out of your bedroom. I have an albacore for you. Let me in. What's that? Smells like an alb albacore. You brought it. Thanks a million. You're welcome, Gus. Enjoy your fish stew. <laughs> Shella didn't say leave the shell on. <laughs> oh my gosh. The eggshells were included in that omelet. Okay. I'm going to try to do a little bit of a different layout for my farm. It might take me a few days to get it set up, but I want it to be ready for spring. So I'm going to ask you, chat, are you willing to go on this journey with me? There may be tears. There may be sadness. There may be cries of disappointment. Are you with me? I need to, uh, get all my tools here. There we go. How was born ready? All right, let's start by getting rid of this path for now. Because I would like to move my barns and coops down here. I think that's the main plan. And eventually I might just have coops down here only, but at this time I have a barn and a coop. Hi, Tony. Do you need something? No. Okay. Not the tension. Sorry, I'm just trying to focus. So oh, you standing behind me is not a good vibe. <laughs> Please don't do that. <laughs> Yay! Oh my god, it's giving me my fences back. Wait, this is big. Because I have the no fence decay mod. Woo! Big day for us. Big day for us. Okay. 
Here we go. We're gonna figure this out. Um. When I'm moving buildings, chat, do I have to cut down this grass? I think I do, right? Like that will technically like block it from being moved. Yeah, okay. All right, I'm gonna go to Robin's. And my hope is that I can do a little switcheroo. Oh shoot, I gotta run to make it to Robin's. I don't know if I'll be able to move the greenhouse today, but I do want to move my coop in my barn. Does it destroy the grass? I don't know. Oh, grass is the only thing it doesn't count? Okay, good to know, good to know. Yeah, I needed hay anyways, so. Okay, here we go. Robin! Robin, let me in! <gasps> Where is she? It's 420! What the heck? Oh my god, I'm gonna murder her. Robin closes at 4 on Friday? Oh my god. I'm gonna bark. That's okay. I guess I'll spend more time clearing this out today. Actually gonna bark. don't know if I'll need to move that or not. Okay. Also, this apple tree is probably not in a great spot. I'm probably gonna have to move that eventually too. Sorry, everyone. This is probably distressing. I don't know. Maybe it's just me that's distressed watching this. I wanted to have this finished so I wouldn't have to have my farm so scattered. But here we are tomorrow. It's okay. Oh, you shared guinea pig pics in the Discord. <gasps> Love! All right, it's gonna be okay. I'm gonna fix it tomorrow. Everything's gonna be okay, Rochella. You need to calm down. <laughs> uh, you cannot move fruit trees, but you can cut it down and regrow it. You can get your seed back now. They used to not do that. It used to be like you lose the seed and everything, which was like terrible. Um, but the terrible thing is you you have to just wait an entire freaking month <laughs> to get your your fruit tree back, but. That's my apple tree, and I already got the apples I need from the for the bundle. So if I have to move it, it's not gonna like destroy me. If that makes sense. Okay. All right. I'm trying to take deep breaths. I'm trying to be brave. I'm gonna go to bed and wake up and fix everything. Uh... Everything is broken and sad. I thought they grew back quicker if they were higher quality. Um, well, I'm not sure how... I didn't fertilize my tree or anything, so it's definitely not high quality. I don't know what makes it high quality or not. Is it Sophia's birthday today in game? I think so. Okay, today's Sophia's birthday. Sophia, birthday at the top of my list. The bottom, but. Okay, spirits are very happy today. Robin works on Saturday, right? I'm going to lose my mind if she doesn't. 
After a year it goes up a star. Okay, well then yeah, mine's definitely not high quality. It has not been planted for a year, so it will just be a regular fruit tree. Okay. Um, but again, I'm not like that's not a concern of mine. We're gonna be fine. I might keep it there. I, I still haven't decided like if that's gonna be just let me let me see what I have here. Is this the I might move it a little bit. I don't know. We'll see. I'm still on the edge. I'm kind of like making up this layout as I go along, so it's like very rough. But I have a vision in my brain of what I would like. pet everyone i feel like i always miss someone george okay i need to pet george george where are you hi george these pigs have been freaking useless i should not have gotten them <laughs> this early i should have waited until um wait i can shear i should have waited until spring That's okay. Did I pet you? I did. Okay. All right. So plans today. I'm going to go to Sophia and give her the tea. Figuratively and literally. And then I'm going to go to Robin and move my stuff around. Yeah, they'll be ready. They will so be ready to truffle hunt. The truffles are going to be a nice source of income. So I am looking forward to that. Oh, I'm in distress. My farm is so ugly. Okay. Here we go. Star drop tea. Okay. Oh yeah, I have not checked my greenhouse yet no star fruit i think it has another day or two it's close it's in its final like height stage now i think i have to wait till i see like the ball and then once i see the ball it will be like a day or two whoops that was dumb of me i messed up that's okay all right Here we go, here we go. On my way to Sophia's. I'm excited. This is my first time giving this tea as a gift for someone on their birthday. I can give two gifts of one of them as the tea. Hmm. Well, I'm already halfway there. I've, I've already given her two gifts this week, so I don't know. I don't know if I can or not. That'd be kind of OP if you could give them, like, two gifts on their birthday. <laughs> Hi, Sophia! Happy birthday! Wait. Okay. I was scared. I thought I almost gave her the wrong thing. You remember my birthday! I'm beyond speechless! I was hoping I would get something like this. What do you call the cheese that isn't yours? Nacho cheese. Oh my god, goodbye. Nope. Not this. Tony makes jokes like that IRL, and now I want to date someone who makes jokes like that in game? No, I can't escape it. Is that just my taste? I hate it here. Get me out of here. It's my own personal hell. Okay. Alright, this is a big day. Today we're going to go move my barn. 
And my coop. You did say your favorite thing is cheese. That's true. I have a type. My type is dad jokes, apparently. Rip. All right, Robin. I'm coming over. If Robin is not working today, I think I'm going to projectile poop everywhere. I'm not even kidding. I'm going to be so mad. Not a cutscene. Oh my god. <sighs> hey, Shella. I was just cleaning some dust off my saw. Great, Robin. Have you ever made anything out of wood? Yes. Great, then this blueprint should be a piece of cake for you. What blueprint? I think we've become good enough friends that I can trust you with my carpentry secrets. Here, let me show you the blueprints. For what? Flute block and drum block. Oh, thanks, Robin. Feels good to be able to decorate your house with things you made yourself. Oh my god, Neural, that's terrible. <laughs> hey, yeah, I'm still online for a little bit. Not too much longer. I'm still hanging out. All right. I have to decide where I want those to be. Um, all I know is that I for sure would like um, this area to be fenced in. Maybe I can line it up with this path. And then I can create a little fence around that. I actually think that's kind of cute. I think that's kind of slay. I think that's kind of cute. I could even keep the greenhouse here if I wanted to. I don't need to move it, but I was going to move it up here. To be so real with you. I just think that makes a little bit more sense, maybe. A little bit closer to everything. And then I can have maybe another fish pond in here. Um, I have to figure out what to do with all of this over here. I think, like, eventually I want to make it so that, like, my barns are here. With this pond. I don't know. I feel like this makes sense. So one, two, two. So that way the path can come here. Yeah, I think the greenhouse is really cute up here. Do you guys like it up here? We could have like some fruit trees kind of around maybe. I'll have to like fix this area of the fence, but that's okay. But I think it looks kind of nice there. I'm thinking like the barn, maybe. I could put the silo in the middle, but I think that's a little uggo mode. Where could the silo go? Maybe right there? I don't know, is that crazy? I feel like that's okay. Put it right there. Yeah, I'm thinking of an orchard like here, maybe. In this space. We'll have to see. I could put like another fishing pond here as well for a different kind of resource. Yeah, I like it next to the greenhouse too. And then like having maybe like some sheds or something. Making wine with your fruit can make good money for the winter. Yes, I just don't have um kegs yet. So I think if I were to put fruit in the 
these things, um, it would turn into juice. So I would need to upgrade my house and get the the wine cellar. I'm pretty I'm pretty sure. I could be wrong, but um, yeah, I could turn this entire area all the way down to here with all this blue grass into like an animal. You can make wine already. Yeah, with grapes. But if I put fruit in there, does it turn into? It would make wine. Oh, well. I guess I'm dumb. I don't know what to say. I guess I'm just dumb. <laughs> uh, I would like to make a shed eventually. That's a cute shed. Okay, fish pond, cabin. Okay. Well, I want my stable too. Is there, okay, this slime hutch, I think is the ugliest thing I've ever seen. I wonder if I can find like a cute slime hutch skin, something that's not so disgusting. I don't want like a mad scientist castle lab laboratory on my girly pop cottage core sleigh farm. No offense. Tony always likes having Linus as his bestie, too. Um, purple office chair. Okay, he pulled my leg. <laughs> Don't you dare insult your brain. It's too late. I've already done it. Okay, now I get to spend the rest of today setting up my farm. This is quite exciting for me. Hi, Linus. What's up? I'm pretty sure Linus just likes food. Okay. I'm liking that layout. It might look a little rough, but I promise as soon as I put some fences down, you guys are going to be like, she's a genius. Look at her go. We're so proud of her. Hi, Leah Nikki. Thank you for the seven month free sub. Welcome back. Thank you. Thank you. I just want to impress you, chat my goal okay um bones clay slay Linus basically likes any forageable yeah yeah he's just like oh thanks where'd you find that okay let me get some wood and some stone All right, let's just um, cut this down. These are not going to give me my fences back because these have been here since the beginning of time. Actually, why am I cutting those down? I feel like I, I want those to be there. Just kidding. That was dumb of me. Um... Honestly, I kind of liked it, having like the fences. Maybe I'll just put them back. I don't know why I did that. I was just planning ahead. I didn't know like where I wanted the greenhouse to go and stuff. Okay, so let me put this back. That's okay, sometimes we, we go a little overboard. I'm I do that all the time. This will be our new um entrance to the greenhouse and then i liked having this kind of around it i thought that this looked really cute i don't think i like the fence being up here so i might actually move this down a little bit maybe like right here instead it doesn't take much to impress you. <laughs> well, good. Then I must be doing a great job. Um, okay. Oh, there's options with L's building. Oh, maybe I do have options. L's town buildings? No. L's... Farm type manager? I don't know. 
Is this it? I don't know what true or false means. <laughs> I just put true. I'm scared. I don't know how to work this mod. I just click buttons and hope that it happens. I should really like read into it a little more. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay. And then I want to put this bin. Maybe I'll put this bin down by the um, animals. Oh my gosh, I'm sending good vibes for your kitty. And yeah, if you wanna if you wanna send a link, we have a, a Stardew channel in Discord. Links are not allowed in my chat because of people who have ruined it for everyone else. Unfortunately. You really hate to see it. Um, okay. I need to do college work, but this is too chill. You could do college work and this. Think about it that way. Start writing that essay and stuff. I feel like... I feel like I kind of want stepping stones. Hold on. Rustic flooring. I like the idea of like stepping stones. I don't know. It's radio. I got to record, which is lame. And I only want Stardew. No degree. <laughs> I'm sorry to hear that then. That's frustrating. All right. I definitely don't know what the heck I'm going to do over here. This is where my apple tree is. So I could just start a little sleigh orchard over here, but... I don't know. My brain can't think that far in advance. Tomorrow's the last day of winter, and then I have to plan all my spring stuff. I might save that for next episode, actually. Sheds, maybe? Yeah, maybe I could do, like, a row of sheds or something. I do want to make, like, another farmable patch of land. Eventually. Um, so I kind of have to look and see where I, where I would do that. Gotta build that suspense, it's true. Everyone's gonna wonder what's gonna happen in the spring. Um, I'm not sure what the most profitable fish are. The reason I have a fish pond personally is for the, um, I want to use lava eels for a spicy eel recipe. That's like my main reasoning for it, but I'm not sure what's good for profit, unfortunately. But I think I would get another fish pond after looking up what fish is good for profit. What should I name my new farm? Oh my gosh, chat is actually really good at farm name suggestions. Chat, we need help. They always like to know if you're looking for a serious name or like a goofy name. That's usually their main question. I feel like I just deleted that path and put it back. It's fine. Yeah, I could do like a row of orchard right here. That's kind of fun. I feel like I could plant another tree there, maybe. Wouldn't, wouldn't I be able to plant a tree here? Because it's like got all eight tiles around it. I think I can. Corporate farm. <laughs> Oh my goodness. I don't need this uh, fence anymore. I think so. Okay, yeah, I can plant a tree there then. Maybe I will turn that into a an orchard. Sounds kind of exciting. At least like a couple trees could go here. Might have to be one lower. Apparently lava eel is also number one for profit, but second is blobfish and third is sturgeon. I have blobfish, let me tell you. I most certainly do have blobfish and I love them. I think they are glorious little critters. 
Oh boy. Girls? Hey, leave her alone. They freaking slammed my door open. <laughs> Someone's having a fight. You heard that hiss? Yeah, it was pretty loud. <laughs> they, uh, they get into little, um, tiffs every once in a while, as cats do. It's mostly because Olivia initiates play, and then as soon as Rayla starts playing back, she's like, whoa, 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 what are you doing? You're not allowed to do that. She gets, like, really mad about it. Like, Olivia, girly pop, you can't, you can't just do that to someone. If you're the one initiating play, you need to let her play, too. All right, we're going to figure this out. This one's behind the coop. Hey! Oh my god, I don't know where Tony is. I can hear them just like messing with each other. They're getting restless. Okay. So eventually I'm going to like get more coops and fill up this area and I think I might make like a barn section as well so they'll be a little bit separated. No, that's not where I wanted it. Ah. Oh, I don't want to pass out. No. <laughs> you heard them again too. Yeah. I mean, Olivia's not quiet. When she's upset, she freaking screams like she will let you know that she's unhappy. I feel like this is probably big enough for now. At least we have like the vibes. That's the most important thing. We're getting we're getting the vibes. You guys can kind of see it coming together. So that way my main thinking is like how cute is this as like a little duck pond, right? And then all the grass will grow and stuff. It'll be really nice. It's going to be so cool. All right. Well, definitely a work in progress, but I think that this is a good stopping point for us tonight. We're going to have to figure out what happens next time. We're like literally days, a day away from spring year two. So everything is about to get super pretty again. Super vibrant. Really looking forward to that. It's gonna be nice seeing the green again. Yay! I'm glad you, I'm glad they helped you find a name. That's awesome. Whew. They said if you won't end stream, we will. <laughs> I know, it's so funny. It's so funny. All right. This was a lot of fun. I just want to say thank you for hanging out with me today, chat. This was this was a good time. I'll be back again tomorrow with some more Stardew. <laughs> Not this save file, though. We're going to be playing with my friend Violet in our multiplayer save file. And this time we're prepped. Like, we have all of our mods ready and stuff, so it shouldn't be a, a disaster like it was last time. Um, Dang. Oh my gosh, we just went over our 500,000 gold mark. Year one. That is crazy. 500k in one year. I'm gonna pat myself on the back for that one. Um, but yeah, I had I had a really good time. Literally, I'm crazy. I'm so crazy. Um, but yeah, thank you everyone for hanging out with me. If you did enjoy the stream, don't forget to hit the follow button so you know when I'm live. My schedule is posted in the Discord. Tomorrow we're gonna be going live at um, 3 p.m. Eastern with Violets and playing for multiple hours. And then I am off on Thursdays and Fridays. And on Saturday, we're doing shell tours in The Sims. And then on Sunday, we're going to be back in this save file going into spring. Um, also, this this Let's Play that I'm doing with my goblin, my goblin grow farm, I'm uploading that to my YouTube channel. So if you're enjoying it, check out the YouTube channel as well. Um, and Not So Berry will be coming out tomorrow as well. So the eagle is in flight. Copy that, Lulu. Not so very will be posted tomorrow as well. Um, but yeah, thank you guys 
thank you for hanging out with me. I seriously had a fun day. Super fun. Always fun hanging out, playing Stardew with you all. Thank you so much for all of the, the subs, the resubs, the new follows, stuff like that. Like, I super, super appreciate it. So, yeah. And it was nice chatting with you guys. So thanks for talking to me. Uh, I always feel like way less low, way less lonely whenever I'm streaming. So thank you for hanging out with me and spending time with me. It means a lot. Um, all right. Let's see who I should raid. Um, oh boy, there's a lot of people streaming Stardew right now. That's so funny. Um, oh my gosh. I kind of want to raid. Let me just see if this person's staying online. I kind of want to raid uh, Julian because I lurk in his streams a lot and that's probably where I'm going to go after I end my stream. So I don't think I've ever raided Julian before. So <gasps> I always get nervous when I raid someone for the first time, but we're going to do it. It's going to be great. Get your knives out. Only stab a little bit. Just a little, a little, a little stabbing. Um, but yeah, thank you guys. I love you all a lot. And um, I will see you all tomorrow with um, hanging out with Violet. So thank you again, everyone, for being here. Yeah, I'm, I'm really excited. Julian's great. If you, if you don't know Julian, he is really fun. Plays a lot of fun games. Um, and currently his farm's name is Rat Ranch and I like it. So let's go hang out. And yeah, I love you guys. See you tomorrow at 3 p.m. Eastern. Bye. Thank you for watching my YouTube video. I don't know what I'm singing. This is my outro, but thanks. See you next time. Love you. Bye.